Hello, 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 hello. Welcome everyone, welcome, welcome, welcome to a Stuart Morley stream. <laughs> uh it's Tuesday evening, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard, uh probably 5 p.m. Pacific Standard, and I guess to some of you who are across the pond, uh that'll be like what, 1 a.m.? Uh or probably even worse, like two or three in the morning. So um Welcome, wel welcome to, you know, a very inconvenient, um, stream for you guys. Uh, but yeah, no, it's, 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 um, appreciate you, um, you guys coming in ne nevertheless. So, uh, so yeah, um, but, but before I like, um, uh, continue even further, uh, my name is Stuart Warley. I am security guard at your local business park and you're probably wondering, uh, Stuart, like, it's Thursday. Like, why aren't you gaming? Um, why are you having, like, a week in review right now? Uh, I wish I could answer that question right now, but I feel like I would rather... Yeah, sorry. <laughs> I'm slurring my words. Um, I would rather answer that probably in the middle of the stream. Um, whilst I, I'm, I'm getting my, um, you know, my Japanese on... Um, sounded bad, by the way. Uh, but yeah, no, uh, I'll be lurking once more. I'm just late for chatting. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah no, 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 it's, it's, I can't, I mentioned before, it is a 1 a.m. Uh, on your front, but yeah, no, th thank you, Luke, uh, for, uh, you know, just, just stop me by, you know, really, really appreciate it. Yeah. Um, but yeah, no, um, where was I? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So you're wondering, like, what? Why am I having a Zatsu Japanese learning stream on a Thursday? All right, like Zanda is like the week isn't over yet, Stuart. And um, yeah, I, I just I just I just I just said like you know I, I would I would come clean in the middle of the stream. So uh, yeah, so I will I will divulge um, said details later on. But um, just to kind of like further clarify what, what I'm talking about here. So this is my schedule for this week, right? And um, it's a bit different. <laughs> so I have Japanese learning here right now, live. Uh, and uh, of course, Friday's off. Yeah, Saturday is like my usual kind of like, you know, like, can tweak things well the weekends to be honest um you know i can i can like tweak the times here and there because it's a weekend you know and, you know it's kind of like your free kind of like area where you can like mix and match uh or mess around with the schedule and yeah um <laughs> given that uh i do collab with a lot of people who are in different time zones as i am um i had to kind of like you know like uh arrange this schedule in some way like the week the weekend as you can see here like the weekend uh we, i have collabs uh coming in uh we're, we're gonna continue with the divinity adventure with scrim and servo and uh tomorrow i get my feet wet with escape from tarkov with again crim and a bunch of people from Luke's um, circle, um, Chez and Tim. So, uh, I'm also slightly, like, not, uh, I am totally unprepared. Like, um, uh, I still, I still don't even have the game installed, right? And, uh, it's gonna be, it's, I, uh, I, 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 I'm not... I mean, I mean, it 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 could be a chaotic kind of fun, but it's gonna be very messy, <laughs> uh, because one, I was told like Escape from Tarkov is a very 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 difficult game. Uh, not say I don't shy away from the chat. I, I don't I don't sh I shy away from the challenges and all that, but um, it's just that you know uh, I'm playing with people who are experienced with this game and. I always fear whenever I'm in that particular position, the particular scenario where uh, 
I have teammates who are considerably have who have considerably more experience than I do in a particular video game. Uh, the pressure is very like tangible. Uh, I did mention that I, I did make it clear to them that uh, it's my first time playing, and um, I will I will most definitely I will most definitely I will most definitely suck. Uh, but um, that 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 fear that pressure will still be present, uh, regardless of how of how like forthcoming I am in terms of my relative inexperience with said game. Wow, that's a lot of words to it. But yeah, yeah, yeah that's basically what's what's happening here. Uh, yeah, so hence why like I'm having this stream right now. I do want to like make this a regular. Because it's my only moment to like, no, or devote some time to devote time to learn the language, as well as like just have a little chat, you know, just like connect with my audience and stuff like that, and like also like kind of get some things off my chest. Uh, but yeah, no, it's 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 also like you know a bit weird for me because I usually like have the weekend review again on a weekend where I have lots of material. To work with because a week just passed right and um that's not the case here we're still in the middle of the week and uh, <laughs> it's gonna be a challenge it's gonna be a challenge but um uh, we'll we'll, we'll, we'll that, that, that's the beauty of like having this kind of like format right um if i you know happen to like you know hit a wall in terms of like you know figuring out what to talk about like i just uh retreat to the japanese right so I, I i'm making good use of my time i am not wasting it uh i am using it to learn a skill uh as well as and if, if ever like you know chat becomes like you know rowdy then you know, i i'm still able to interact with my community so uh so i guess that's basically going to be the order of the day uh, I will um, every now and then I will go through my Japanese, and every now and then like um, uh, what do you call this like go off tangent right and um, you know I'm gonna talk to talk about something that was bugging me or like talk about something that I'm excited about uh, for next week yeah that that sort of thing and uh, before we hit it off. Um, I'm just gonna ask a big meaty. How's everyone doing? <laughs> I'm sorry, like I, I I laid out a big information load on you guys, and I never bought. I didn't even bother asking like how are how are things. So if that's very impolite of me. Uh, truly apologize for that. Uh, but yeah, no. How's everyone doing? Like you know, like on this fine Thursday evening, or where if you're not in this particular time zone, morning or. Yeah, morning. Uh, you know, like, hopefully you guys are doing okay. You know, like, I know, like it's hot outside, but there will relief will come. You know, whether it's man-made or um, just a, a function of time. Um, go, 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 go! Cool yourselves off. <laughs> uh, but yeah, no, it's a. Uh, it's a, it's 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 actually nice weather outside. Like um, I know it's hot, but it's not humid hot. So, uh, so not not necessarily in danger of dying from heat exhaustion. It's just that yeah, like uh, it never occurred to me how difficult it is to like live in a hot country. Um, you can only go so naked, um, to um uh, cool yourself off. Uh, but in a in a cold environment though you can just layer and layer and layer and layer it up and you're gonna you're gonna be snug as a bug so that's kind of like you know the biggest reason why like I kind of slightly am preferring the cold weather now because at least you have you can, you can do something about it but um, if it's hot you're screwed <laughs> uh, but yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it, it's 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 uh, hopefully like you guys are like staying cool. 
uh, heat, is, heat exhaustion is a real thing. Like you get dizzy, you get confused, you get you get visions, and um, we don't want that to happen. So yeah, I I, I care about my community. So uh, so yeah, uh, I guess on that bombshell, like let's go and begin with our exercises uh, on the hiragana side. So. Let me just uh, expand the table here, just so you guys can really appreciate what the hell I'm doing here. Um, yeah. Okay. Cool. All right. So, all right. To people who are like familiar with how things go around here, uh, basically I have this program to my right, the Anki flashcard program, and it's going to just basically like. Uh, oh, hello, Wither. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Uh, yeah, just, just, again, doing my usual explanation of how things are going to work in these streams, so. Uh, but yeah, yeah I, I need to do it. And, um, where was I? Oh, yeah, yeah, so this program will basically just flash me some cards. And the goal here is for me to not to look to my left, which will be your right. Because in my in my left will be like the table where essentially it's a cheat cheat sheet, right? And uh, yeah, I should not be looking to my left. So given that, uh, you know, I'm all, I'm a firm believer in show rather than tell. Uh, let's see if things are working on our end. Uh, so let's start with the basic hiragana. Uh, study now and this is right off the bat of a no all right things are working things are working right so, so that's how it works uh uh and the goal of like this this anki thing is to is for me to just buy muscle memory i don't even like look or even think uh, what these characters or symbols like supposed to sound or mean, right? Uh, I just, I just, I just, I just, you know, answer them as quick as I can, and that's basically like a, that's basically evidence that um, these phonetic libraries are like in your head, like they're like, you you come across some Japanese text and like, you do not take like maybe like two or three seconds trying to figure out what that character or symbol means or to some extent what the word is so um so that's so that's kind of what, what we're doing here and uh yeah right out the bat i i i got this right right off the bat sorry i seem to keep saying bat all the time by the way <laughs> I'll, I'll talk about that later um so good and this is a uh no that's it. Uh, I mean, of course, like that's not all of the characters um, in the in the hiragana table. It's just that Anki kind of knows uh, that. Okay, like Stuart kind of knows already the hiragana. So let's just give him like a like a few smattering of characters to like mem uh, review, and so that he can move on to the next set of decks, right? So, uh, so that's what I appreciate about this program is that it it kind of like analyzes where you are and responds in kind so uh so that we're, we're done with the uh the basic hiragana let's go with advanced hiragana now um study now uh it's... why am i why am i why am i why am i oh. uh, this is Jew. Do. Oh, 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 I see, I see. Oh, I, I, I misused, I mis, misinterpreted this. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Yeah, 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 yeah. dang, I, uh, screwed up for a moment there. Uh, we can edit that out later. Uh, so again, so I put. 
I clicked again there uh, because I failed and uh, I want Anki to repeat that um, flashcard to me so I can respond better next time. Uh, so this one is, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not looking, I'm not looking, chat. Uh, uh, za? Z. Oh, scheisse. <laughs> yeah, uh, oopsies. No, we'll, we'll edit that out later. Uh, spe? Be. Good. And. Oh, po. Po. Uh, and this is, uh, tzi? Z. Good. And, uh, zu. Zu. There you go. So, thankfully, it didn't um, throw me with more hiragana there. I probably have slightly forgotten, or maybe I'm just a bit tired. Again, like, I usually don't do, like, these, like, um, Japanese language learning streams on an eight, on a, uh, in an, e on an evening, right? So I am slightly tired. Uh, so we go with the deck here, and then we'll move on to the basic katakana. Uh, again, two people are unfamiliar with what's happening here. I'm basically just... Oh, hello, princess. Oh. <laughs> lurking. Okay, okay, she's lurking. I shouldn't, I shouldn't like... I think I think that's the etiquette, right? Like, if someone's lurking, you don't, like, ask how... You know, you don't ask them questions. Like, they think they they're have other business to do, right? So, so, yeah. I'll do that. I'll do that. Okay. <laughs> yep. Yeah, you just, just, just stay there. You know, just relax to the... Sweet sounds of my struggles in learning Japanese. Uh, that said, it might be a bit. My BGMs might be might be a bit too loud. Yeah, let me just lower it, lower it a bit here. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Uh, all right. So we're gonna move on. Oh, sorry. Yeah, yeah I was explaining. Um, so uh, katakana basically is a way. Uh, well, let me just scroll it up a bit for you guys to see. Uh, <clears throat> katakana is basically a way for the Japanese to write out uh, loan words. So, um, and sometimes they use this. I just I just read I just read read up on this, and it makes and I've I've seen evidence of this. Uh, they use this to emphasize um, words, certain words. Uh, just. Kind of, kind of, kind of wicked, right? Like, like you, you don't have that thing in English. I think. Oh, sorry. No, we do. We do. It's just um, uh. The, so basically, the equivalent of this in English is to uh, is the use of the italic font. You know how like in Microsoft Word, like when you want to kind of like emphasize something, well, you could use the bold kind of font face, but people tend to use italics to kind of like uh, direct the attention of the reader towards a particular like word or character. The Japanese have a similar relationship with with that in term and how they and, and how they like um, uh, yeah, they, ex they exhibit that is through the use of katakana. So uh, that's kind of like, you know, in a way, like I, 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 when I learned that, like, I, okay, all right, um, now, now that that makes sense to me because I was like seeing katakana characters, but they weren't necessarily like saying things like you know like terebi or uh, you know escalator. <laughs> they were just saying like some random sounds that was like you know wait uh, we don't have that in English. I mean, but it could be like some. Something taken from French or German, but nah, it was like nah, nah. <laughs> why? Why are you guys using katakana for this? And apparently, that's what they do. So, uh, you learned something new today. Uh, well, I or probably, hopefully, you guys also learned something. And yeah, I guess in that bombshell, we'll we'll start with the basic katakana. Uh, study now. Uh, this is ta. Ta. Oh scheisse. Okay. Um, I forgot to like switch to my Japanese keyboard. There you go. 
I have a Japanese keyboard. Well, it's more of like a Microsoft IME input method editor. Um, you can you can like look it up. If you're using a Windows machine, um, you can activate like the Japanese mode. Uh, and in said mode, uh, you can basically type Romaji or basically like the English alphabet and make it like translate it or make it translate what you wrote in English to uh, either hiragana or katakana. Um, and it also has like that function where like um, it'll kind of like, you, you know, you know, I'm not sure if you guys have like done programming or at least as a hobby or at least maybe if, maybe in a school assignment or something. But uh, whenever you type something in your editor, um, the, the program kind of guesses what you're trying to like accomplish there and provides you basically a drop down of choices um, to, to like, you know, to use. And it's the same thing here. Like, um, so in the Japanese mode, uh, like late, or at least like, you know, when you're like in a Windows machine and you activate the Japanese mode, when you, when you write something in either hiragana or katakana, um, as you write stuff, uh, Windows will try to kind of like guess what you're trying to say and um, will will kind of like give you like uh, choices along the lines of like, are you writing something and just playing hiragana or katakana or even like mixing some kanji. And yeah, it, 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 it's it's... One of the things where, like, when I first started, like, learning Japanese, I was, like, only focusing on the katakana and hiragana. And so there, it, it was showing kanji to me at some uh, at some point. And I was like, I don't need this right now. And then once I moved on to the kanji and the grammar, then I started to realize, okay, this is actually pretty useful. Because I will explain later on why, if you're, if you're kind of, like, if you're, like, uh, serious about learning Japanese, or that's serious, but if, if you're like curious, right? Uh, kanji is actually important, and I will, I will explain after we are done through our katakana exercises. Uh, so this is uh, Ri. Ri. So, see, um, good. This is uh, Ma. Ma. Okay. This is. Uh, I looked. What? What? Ah, uh, I looked. I looked. Oh wait, no, 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 no. Okay, okay, okay. I think, I think, I know the problem. I know the problem. Chat. Um. No, I. I no, 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 no. You know what? You know what? You know what? Uh, I, 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 I can deal. I can deal. I can deal. Uh, I, I, I did. I didn't look. I didn't look. Um. They're good. No, I didn't. I don't. I should put that again. God dang it. Okay. Cool. 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 Uh, this is se. Se. I struggled for a bit there, so I'm gonna put that to hard. Uh, yo. Yo. Uh, yeah. Uh, you. You. Mhm. Mm uh. Ho. Ne. Eh. Oh. God. Ah. Again. 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 I screwed that up, Jed. Uh, mu. Mu. Good. Uh, re. De. Mm hmm. Uh, nani kore? Uh, ro. Ro. Good. Uh, mm? Mm. Uh, oh, jeez. De. Te. Ya. O. Ah, ho. O. Uh, eh? I have to look. What's this? Me? Okay. It's me, but I'll, me. I'll go. I'll go again. I'll again that. So, oh, this one is uh oh. Oh. Yeah. Uh, good. And this is so. So. Mhm. Mm ah, uh, so. Uh, no. No. Uh, eh. Eh. Mm. Sa. Sa. Eh. Uh, da. Oh, sorry. Yeah, 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 that's ah. God dang it! God dang it! Yeah, that's ah. Whoopsies. Uh, 
นะทะเอ๊โอ้ยัสกาเดงิตกาเดงิตเออเน่เน่กูดเออระดะเม่เม่เอเดอ่าอ่าทะ Yes, Krishna is the the one with the T. It 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 it's 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 it's, it's kind of confusing, but you just you just you, you just have to memorize them again. This is how you two people who are like uh who don't whose language is not like you know their native language isn't English, right? Um, when when. And I'm gonna count myself in that particular group, okay? So when I learned English, um, it was basically a, my teachers, uh, making me like do the same things over and over again. It was irritating, it was annoying, but um, look where I'm at right now. Still at a reasonably like bad um, command of English, but. I think I'm still able to kind of convey kind of like what I'm trying, what I try, what I want to convey here. So, but yeah, it, it's it's unfortunately if you're if you're attempting to learn language, it's it's just gonna be a lot of memorization. So, you know, it's it's not like it's gonna harm you, right? So, but yeah, it's having to like kind of like just figure out like okay, that's that's a na, oh no, that's a ta because. The na is like has a t, yeah. It it's kind of weird, and this will get pr- progressively worse once we cover kanji. So, uh, so we covered the basic katakana, and so the last deck here will be the advanced katakana. Study now. Uh, this is a ju, ju, right, and this is a. Zu. Okay, I should have put that to hard. I took a while there. Um. Uh. Yeah, let's go over me. Um. Bio. Bio. Hard. Okay, I took a while there. So this is how I like. You. Um. Kind of like grade myself, right? So if if I'm not, if I'm not super yeah. fat. Oh yeah, it is. Yes, 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 yes. Again, again, again. I'm gonna put that to again. Um. So this is shu. Shu. Okay. Because if 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 I don't like get this like off the bat, like just like at the tip of my tongue, then no, I have to put that to hard. So this is a a uh, hu. Hu. Mm-hmm. Uh ah, this one's a mu. Mu. Uh. Uh, you, you, a new, new, uh, oh, pe, pe, uh, hmm, go, zo, oh shit, what the, oh yeah, there's, I'm doing, okay, okay, I I I screwed that up, chat. Um, so this is uh pew, pew. Mhm. Uh, a e p. Yeah. Uh q q. Mhm. Ah. Mm. Chu. Chu. Uh. Pio pio. Pio. Mhm. Uh kyo. Yo. Uh oh. Gyu. Gyu. Eh. Pa. Pa. Hmm. Uh. Zo. Zo. Eh. Nya. Nya. There you go. So yeah, it's it's. I'm kind of already that. I'm already kind of like I would say like if I grade myself. From uh, one being like 
bad and five being like very good um reading katakana and hiragana i would grade myself a 3.5 uh because yeah like some some of this like it's just like i could just read right off the bat but some kind of give me pause i don't know it's just probably like i'm i just need to like continue to like subject myself to this to this rote memorization uh but yeah it, it, it's 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 just it's just a thing it's just a thing so um you just have to go through with it and uh i guess on that bombshell like i i could i could uh now talk about like uh something that i want i want to bring up and uh and that is like uh so so yeah yeah i get to like two people who are like unfamiliar with my format here so i would i would i would like go through my lessons and then every now and then i would like kind of like uh move away from said lessons kind of like just break the monotony right i've i've i've, I've discovered this how like people like not burn themselves out burn themselves out whenever they're studying is to take breaks right and my break is to just is to rant about something <laughs> so um and that something is uh apparently uh i, I mean i've only like met a few other vtubers and I'm using the adverb or the adjective probably very accurately here because we have, we are there's a lot of us out there. Um, but just gauging from the VTubers that I know and I talk with, uh, I happen to be on that particular category that streams a lot. Um, uh, so I'm not entirely sure if you guys like, um, are realizing this, but, uh, so, well, uh, I guess I'll bring, I'll pull up my schedule once more. Uh, I stream four times a week, right? And, uh... I am struggling to look for other people or other VTubers that have the same frequency. Uh, you know what I mean? Like I, 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 um, I'm telling you, uh, I think it's a good thing that I'm streaming a lot, um, because a lot of people want to stream that, that is the, that is unanimous, right? Um, uh, some people will say like, oh, like, you know, like, uh, I don't want to stream right now. Uh, but they say it along the lines of like, I'm tired at the moment. I'm, I'm physically exhausted or like, you know, I'm not in that m mental headspace yet. Right. And, and that, that adverb yet, that, that particle yet, um, speaks volumes and it, it's, it's, uh, it, it's basically like they want to stream. They, they, they really want to. It's just that, yeah, like they, they have other pressing, pressing matters to like uh, attend to. So yeah, they would like stream maybe like twice a week or even maybe once a week, right? Um, just to accommodate uh, those other pressures. And it's, uh, yeah, it, it's, it's, I, I, I often, I, I seem to have like, I seem to be like doing more streams than the, your than your average VTuber, because um, I uh, was looking at other VTubers, um, especially the Corpo ones, right? Um, by the way, like um, if you guys are you know familiar with the VTuber world, uh, uh, it's I guess it's it'll be remiss not to like, and I, I I'm not entirely sure how you've never heard of like the two big like um companies corpos um in vtubing i think one of them um 
I think one of them is graduating, I think. Um, and the other just basically released a new, um, I guess, wave, I guess you will. And uh, speaking of those Scorpo uh, VTubers, um, yeah, like they they have the resources basically to support um, said VTubers, right? And uh, to the point that the VTubers can devote pretty much, you know, 100% of their time just doing content creation. And um, so this is the kicker, right? So I, I opened this up with me like streaming four times a week, right? And now we're approaching, so just, 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 Follow me here. Follow me here. Like uh, uh, the, the the try try to keep up. Try to keep up. Um, so I stream four times a week. Yet I'm not a corpo VTuber, so I don't have the supports or anything like that. Uh let's let's take one of those VTubers from those two big companies I talked about. Well, I didn't really mention their names, but I think you know who I'm talking about. Um. Uh. I, I, I grabbed one of them. Like, I, I mean, I, I not physically grab, but I'm just saying, like, I just, I just took, 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 <laughs> the word took's also not that um, appropriate neither. Uh, l l we, I, I, I looked into one. Yes. All right, you know what? Let's just go back with the, back to that uh, verb grab, okay? And, um, yeah, it, it, it's, it's, I, I I looked into their like bots and I noticed like in a three month period, in a four month period where I have been like streaming around that time, I happen to have more VODs than them. So I've like, this is weird. Like, why do I have more streams than the Corpo VTubers? Uh, so that kind of like underscored kind of like, wow, I, I stream a lot. I'm not trying to share their quality streams, <laughs> but I do stream a lot uh, co compared to your average VTuber, especially like the indies and the small ones, which is, you know, I am extremely tiny compared to like my um, contemporaries um, here. I am very tiny in terms of like my footprint. Uh, and yeah, it's, it, it, it's, it's, and it's, it's, it, it's manifesting uh, but the fact that I have a lot of VODs sitting in my hard drive, I've yet to upload to my YouTube, which by the way is here. Um, I will like do a little command here, uh, YouTube. Yeah. So that's my YouTube channel. I basically push VODs there. Um, and you might notice too, like, very very super fans out there uh that there is a considerable gap right now um in terms of like what's uploaded there right i think um my last upload there was my first trailmaker stream which is if i were to like go through my um uh what you call this my um, schedules let me let me let me look for my schedules here uh, trail makers. Nope. Um, hello. Uh, nope. That's wait, what was that far? Oh, probably it is. It was that far back. Oh, okay. Um, dang. Uh, I really need to get cracking then. Um, holy sh. But, but, but you, you can see where, oh, yeah. So here it's like, uh, it's like almost July 10th to July 16th. Yeah. This is the latest like VOD in my, in that channel. I've yet to upload these two. And this was like three weeks ago. So yeah, it's, it's, it's. <laughs> so not only do I have like the problem of like, I have, I'm well, not sure that's a problem per se. I would to say like, I have a problem of like streaming a lot. Uh, I have a problem of like uploading these VODs to the YouTube channel. Um, and, uh, yeah, it, it's, 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 a, it's a long story. I, I kind of like, um, had some things, to, uh, 
look into uh, in terms of in real life stuff. And uh, yeah, yeah, it's it. Uh, I figured like the the vods can wait, you know. Uh, but yeah, I'll, hopefully by tomorrow I should have like some of these uploaded. And yeah, and you're probably wondering, right? Like, I'm uh, Stuart. Like, I mean, like a few people, and I say, I say that, I, I say this like very literally. Like, um, I think only a few people watch it on. <laughs> but um, uh, and I'm cognizant of that, very cognizant of that. Um, but it's more of like, uh, I've noticed though that um, P uh, you know what? Just to like kind of give you guys a what uh kind of a picture of what i'm talking about here so this is my channel and uh yeah it's it's pretty um you know <laughs> simple so you can see how like you know like there's only maybe a smattering of views right which i i, I got to expect um oh did well what happened here i think my um uh, my stuff just suddenly like um anyway so yeah and yeah you're the, the question is like Stuart, like why why bother like uploading these bots, right? Um, and the thing is like, uh, when I came across content creation the first time, right? Uh, you know, like you you're like an impressionable like young lad, right? Um, you get into a certain niche like an interest, and then you enjoy said thing. So you look for said thing, and said thing is basic could basically be a specific video game, a um like uh you know like a th th like something like you know something as so esoteric or niche as like you know cooking or something. I don't know. That's not even like niche at all. Uh, but the point here is that um people will like search for this, such a thing. Will search for that kind of contact content. Whether they're looking, I, Minecraft is a it's a horrible example because everyone and their scented mother plays this game. But um, what if they want to watch We Were Here content, right? What if they wanted to watch Trail Makers, and they will look that up. They will search it. They will search that in YouTube, right? They would really like search like with my name on it, right? Um, uh, yeah, it's it's out there. Hey doing my seo um but no it's not it's i'd say like no maybe they want to watch a vtuber like play that game and no nope, no i'm not, I'm not uh, first page <laughs> so not there yet yet not there yet but the what i'm trying to say here is that yeah it's um it's people will like look for the content and that's kind of like why I, I i do this why i upload the vods in youtube uh, is that like people will actually have those interests and they will like actively search for them. Uh, and uh, in some small part, like I also do this so I can like, you know, have an archive or a ready archive of things. <clears throat> so yeah, that that's kind of like the problem I have. Uh, excuse me right now. And uh, yeah, it, it's, it's, um, it's a nice problem to have. Um, I have lots of content sitting around. It's just a yeah. It's um, I've kind of um, uh, fallen, uh, fallen behind, if you will. Uh, on the uploads. So uh, yeah. Okay. So let's just take this. Let's take this down. And uh, let's go back. And where were where 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 were we? Okay. All right. So, uh, let's see what we have here. Uh, okay, so, yeah, probably, like, uh, we can start with the conjugation next. But before uh, before we do, I'm just going to go for a quick washroom break. Um, just give me a moment, Jed. I'll be right back.
Oh my god. Alright, big <laughs> Yeah. Uh yeah. So um Yeah. Oh god. Woof. Alright, that felt no, I mean it's uh, it's, it's gonna it's not really bad. I was about to say that felt good, but with a little inflection there. Um yeah, so uh where were we? Oh yeah. So we're gonna now approach the the grammar in Japanese, and uh, a little bit of backstory. Um, I first went in to the vocabulary thing. So I got this like deck here, the Japanese Core Three K vocab. I went in, it. and right off the bat, I was like, "Nah." If this is what I'm gonna go through, go through three thousand Japanese words with kanji, most likely uh, like eighty percent there, ninety <clears> percent. <throat> I'd j basically just be learning words, right? Imagine, just imagine, you as an English speaker, not a being not able to say like the word and or uh through or yet or um so or the right that's that's basically like you're just learning words like dog cat um uh, day night um uh, people uh microphone uh popcorn um uh, chocolate a uh, monitor keyboard mouse notebook webcam uh, iPhone, microphone. Uh, <laughs> I'm just saying things. That's what's in front of me. Um, but yeah, that's basic. That's basically like what was happening. And I'm like, no, I, I, I probably, I, I can't, I can't. This is, this is, this is gonna be demoralizing. Uh, because no, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not getting any right. So, uh, that sounded really bad. By the way, um, um. Uh, but so yeah, so I realized okay, I should just learn the grammar, and thankfully we got a guy here uh, who goes by at least uh, in his website here, Tai Kim, uh, and I really like how he structured kind of like his grammar um, introduction to um, learners. Because it's it's very like digestible, and that's kind of like what I'm trying to do here. I'm I'm learning grammar. I'm going to learn grammar first. After like of course I've learned the uh, hiragana and katakana already, but um, I'm going to learn grammar first, and uh, you will it it will it will always come to a point when you're learning grammar to also learn some kanji, right? So this is what I like about going to the grammar first. Right, because uh, it'll force you to learn some kanji along the way. Uh, for example, like hito or uh, gakuse or uh, genki. Uh, so, yeah, it, it, it's 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 uh, you know, it, it's nice. It's nice to like actually like uh, be able to like form a thought, say a thought in Japanese, while uh, while like learning like. Like, like and also learn the words. So this one, for example, like hito da or genki da, or, you know, uh, gakusei da or uh, genki da. Uh, yeah, it's basically just a, a uh, with this first grammatical st structure, like declaring something is so using like da, right? So this is the <coughs> excuse me, the hiragana for da, and yeah, you 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 basically use da to just declare something. Uh, no, as is like what what is what is this <laughs> all right so uh yeah is so the example here is a person this one is a student or is well so hito da gakusei da or uh genki da so and yeah i i did i do know like that you know right off the bat this is a person this this, this character is a person because it's mr t again like you you will see me like uh, go insane figuring out like why this kanji means like uh, is is has that meaning right because 
we are doing a lot of word associations and even like uh, transfixing kanji together um, to determine the meaning of that symbol. It's 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 super like complicated. I I mean I don't I don't want to like scare you guys from like learning Japanese, but it's it's just compared to like English, compared to the Latin alphabet, like these guys have literally like have had it right <laughs> these guys have like all right you know what let's go and like make a character out of every single thing we see or think think about and they did, did just that and now they have a three thousand uh you know number of symbols to like worry about in terms of like how do we like express that in writing <laughs> because they they went they went all ham on like just I know, just putting a just having a single character pin a particular like thought or thing, uh, and probably like they shouldn't have done that, but <laughs> but here we are, uh, we are like uh, paying for their mistakes. <laughs> no, I, I, I'm just joking. If people are actually like you know actually admire the Japanese language, which I which I which I include myself in. It's just, it's just yeah I'm just I'm just coping, uh, but yeah yeah this so yeah uh, basically if you must know, um, I have this RTK program here. Uh, okay, let me just um, open it up for you guys so you can see kind of like how things are like cooking. Um, turn off that. Turn off this. RTK on. Yeah. So this is basically a. Um, uh, a kanji database. So, uh, what does it do? Well, I search for person here, and it will show me the appropriate kanji character. And it will tell you the onyomi reading and the kunyomi reading, which I will explain later. Or I can explain right now. Basically, but you know, I'll explain later. And um, how people like like me, um, Japanese language learners, are able to like figure out like that. This particular symbol is a person. So they would say something along the lines of behold Mr. T of A Team Fame. And right off the bat, you're wondering how the hell, what where in the god awful world did Mr. T just how did he just how did he came into view here? Apparently, uh for people like us, people like who are well I'm saying if if, if you're actual literal Japanese masters here um maybe you're not included in this particular sweeping generalization but uh yeah apparently like when yeah uh, native no i'm not even i don't i can't even call myself a native english speaker but um but for english speakers when they see this character the immediate thought that comes into their heads is that this is mr t and mr t as you all know is a person so, therefore, this symbol means person, right? That's how you learn kanji. And that's not even like, that's not even like, you know, that's even like half, that's half the argument, that's half the battle. Like, I, we, we will get to some kanji where you have to learn other kanji to be able to figure out the kanji you were trying to figure out in the first place. And it it, it, it it gets it gets really complicated. Like but again, as I said before, I don't I'm not in the business to like scare people into learning Japanese. On the contrary, I am I am I am making myself a fool I'm making myself look like a fool here, uh, for people to like uh, uh, get comfortable with the idea of learning Japanese because people get discouraged whenever they see something so complicated and then they just potentially just give up i however have no shame so <laughs> i i will i will i will debase myself i will um, humiliate myself i will uh put myself in a lower degree uh i will uh um uh, i will i will um uh, you know like uh, portray myself as a fool just so like you can see like you know like it's okay it's okay to be to look dumb in the internet right um, 
and because that's how you learn you learn based on your mistakes and um it, it's 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 just it's just it's just in a way it, it's kind of fun it's kind of fun to like figure out the kanji for this i i i i um i have thoughts in my head i play with my thoughts and like you know it, it it's i don't know i don't know it, it, it it's 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 i don't know what you guys but it, it is fun so so yeah hitoda gakusei da genki da and uh yeah that's uh yeah this is a person this is a a um a this this this, this means study right this this symbol this 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 lone symbol here the one i'm highlighting right now this means study because there's a child underneath like a house and that's that you see that like little like figure there with a stick figure with like he looks kind of like et um that that is the kanji for child and the and the one above so basically if you put like a house above it and with like action lines on top that's probably a child studying in his house hence why like this kanji means study right and this is basically like a a plant that's growing um just from the, like the looks of it so that means it's it's a lot it's alive it's growing so it's alive so this means this this so basically this kanji on its own this this the symbol i'm highlighting this this means life l-i-f-e so and when you combine studying and life right what do you get you get a student so study life student study life student study life student and yeah and when you combine that gakuseida you um basically like if i if i if i search that right so i'm i'm going to i'm going to show you guys what i'm talking about so i'm not ta talking crap here that's study right and if you go to this particular um if you go open up a new like tab uh this is study and life right and um uh, how did i figure out how to pronounce these kanji well there's a thing called onyomi and kunyomi uh in this uh particular well as you particular this is just, this is a universal thing so as people are aware um uh, the japanese didn't really invent their own language uh they borrowed it from the chinese and uh it basically they just diverged uh at some point in history so like they developed their own language as you can see here but the chinese we can you people cannot deny how much the chinese have influenced their language and it it is it is exhibited in kanji. So, how did the Chinese get here? Uh, well, basically, kunyomi is the Japanese reading of this, and onyomi is the original Chinese reading. So, um, when so when you see this character in Chinese, um, people will read it in the onyomi fashion, right? Correct me if I'm wrong, if there are any Japanese pros here, but that's kind of like what I understood. And, and kunyomi is basically like how like the Japanese are. Okay, you know what? Let, 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 let's, 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 don't, let, let, let's not wait for the, chi the approval of the Chinese. Let's go like figure out how this thing is like um, said in our language. And they did the whole kunyomi thing. But you're probably asking, like, Stuart, if the Japanese like, um if the chap if the Japanese did that, then why are we like still learning the Onyomi readings? Good question. Actually I, I also want to know. But um the thing is apparently um when you have more than two kanji or more than one kanji together, uh you do not use the kunyomi reading. Uh so I will I will show this to you. Um, so that, for example, like the hito, right? As you see here, in this particular sentence, uh, it's alone, right? Uh, this 
kanji character is alone, and there's a gana, hiragana character da there. So if it's alone, then it's not paired with another kanji, then it must be using the kunyomi reading. Hito. Hito da. Hito da. Right? But if it's paired, but if the kanji is paired with another kanji to form a word, then you use the onyomi reading. Hence why you don't say for this one, right? You don't say, uh, this is this, um, ma, mana, mana, managu? No, yeah. No, no, manabu, manabu. Yeah, manabu is studying, by the way. Um, manabu, don't say manabu. Um, I probably butchered that, by the way. Sorry. Um, but you say gaku because it's paired with another kanji and then you go to the next kanji. You don't say the kunyomi reading as well here because it, that, this, this, this life guy is paired with the study guy. So you say se. Hence why you say this sentence, you say this word as gakuse, and then the sentence basically means gakuse da, or is a student. So that's basically how like um, kanji works. Uh, yeah, it, it, it's, so not only do you have to figure out like what the, what the kanji is trying, what the kanji means, but you also have to figure out, okay, so um, if it's being paired with that, I must use this pronunciation. If it's us, if it's standalone, then I must use this pronunciation. That said, there, ha there I will, we will get to like some words where uh, my explanation uh, doesn't hold water. And I think it was just going to be like, it's just one of those like few unique cases. I think the, um, the, the word friend um, doesn't ascribe to my um, explanation. I think it's, um, it's going to use a kunyomi reading, even though it's being paired with another kanji character to, to form that word friend. <clears throat> Excuse me, sorry. And uh, yeah, so so hopefully you guys like are following. I, I don't know whether I, I uh, um, if I just overloaded you guys with a lot of information, <laughs> especially the guys who are like in Europe, because it's like what almost um, two a.m., three a.m. <laughs> learning, attempting to learn something on the three at uh, three a.m. Not really like you know, the, like the best kind of like you know like learning environment. <laughs> Um, but yeah, yeah, yeah. It, 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 it's, 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 it's funny, like how, like English and Japanese are so different. Like you don't bother with this in English, but unfortunately in Japanese you do. And in some ways it's fun. I don't know. I don't know. I, I, I guess, I guess as I tell a lot of people like, you know, off stream and on stream, I'm probably the most boring person you're ever going to meet. Um. But that said, I don't. I, I. That's it. I do kind of. Well, you know what? I'm. Gonna, I'm. I'm, gonna, I'm about to say something, really to another person. That's kind of impolite. Um. So I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna go forward with that. But, uh, yeah. It's. 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 Um. Uh, it's fun. It's fun. And you know what? You might find the fun. Um. As as we go through kind of like these exercises, because um. It's. It gets really unhinged later on. <clears throat> Should be so. Um, yeah, let me even do a hydration check. I'm kind of slightly parched, so you see, even like, yeah, even so, even like the, the guy writing this is aware that this is a pain in the butt, but you have, you have to realize, like, um, you don't have to like carry the whole world on your shoulders at that given moment, right? It's okay to make mistakes. Um, that's why you, do, you shouldn't be discouraged if, like, you sound bad right now, which I am right now, actually, so. But, yeah. Uh, so, we've already, like, learned the, the expressing the state of being. Uh, sometimes, what, what th this, on this particular section, is just basically saying, like, uh, oh, yeah, by the way, um, this is uh, a head, and I think I forgot what this is. Let me um bring that up. Uh, 
spirit. Oh no, wait, spirit? And the other is, I think this is a head, right? A head in spirit? Oh, beginning. Oh, oh I see, 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 sorry. I think I'm, I missed it. I'm, I have missed it. Okay, we're going to cover another like word in Japanese that kind of looks similar. This is, this is my pitfall in kanji. I sometimes like go, um, just, just fire off prematurely. Um, but yeah, no. Uh, <clears throat> for this particular kanji character, it's easy because uh, I know it, it. I know the the kanji for two, and the kanji for two is this. That is two ni, right? Uh, so yeah, ni there, and yeah, so basically two lines in horizontal horizontal. And this guy is saying, like, in the beginning, we're just two who walked on human legs. So, uh, 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 a reference to the biblical story of Adam and Eve, where there was, like, just two two people, Adam and Eve, two, and they walked on legs. Two on human legs. Um, so, basically, in the beginning, is it like, you're just, you're just, you're just, you're just grasping for straws here, like the mnemonics about it. So when I see this, all right, two people walking in human legs. So in the beginning, that was a thing. Like Adam and Eve walked in human legs in the beginning. Beginning, 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 beginning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I know. It, 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 it's, it's, it's horrible um, how, like, um, you're being forced to, like... Uh, <laughs> uh reach so far into this to try to get some form of meaning but this is the best we could do um and the thing is you're not alone a lot of native japanese actually like do struggle with kanji um so there there are 3000 kanji characters but they only know maybe like 10% or 20% of it Yes, that's uh, no. I'm, I'm being I'm being liberal here. Um, no, probably like five percent, roughly. Like they don't maybe know like two hundred, a hundred, or you know maybe like one hundred fifty. So yeah, it's 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 <laughs> it's it's a problem they also like have to um, deal with, right? So, but the thing about like Ty Kim's guide here is that um, yeah. He he's aware. He's this is basically like me just you know like praising this guy over and over again. <clears throat> but he's aware of the problems of learning kanji, so he's gonna basically just throw in the usual kanji people use normally, and that's what we're going to learn here. We can just learn the con the other kanji later on, you know, like a a supplement a supplementary kind of like thing. Which, uh, I guess, at some point, I will just like learn on my own. On my own. Uh, the The goal of these streams is for me to at least be conversational in Japanese. I kind of do want to like do a Japanese stream at some point, right? I know I said like, I know I probably advertised in in X that I, I'm gonna have a Japanese stream. I should have like added like a Japanese language learning there. Um, I, I I dabbled in some misinformation. It was so, um, no, I don't I don't speak Japanese. I'm learning. I'm just you know I'm just yeah. Um, I, I I at some point I do want to do like a Japanese stream, right? Uh, because I don't know, I, I like language. You know, not because I'm a weeb, but just because I, no, I, I like language. You know, um, yeah. Plus I look. Plus you sound cool. <laughs> Okay, so yeah, uh, so yeah, beginning and sorry, I um went off tangent there. Yeah, this is normal, by the way. Like I do go off tangent a lot. So, um, and spirit, right? Oh yeah, I hate this. I have no idea how this is like a thing. Okay, so his spirit is like about cursing Wolverine. So this is Captain Hook, apparently. And this is Wolverine, 
because Wolverine stole for his X thing, right? The X Men, right? And um, his spirit crush. To be honest, like what I do, if I don't mesh well with like the explanations in this Kuhi stories, I just brute force my way. Like this is this this character is spirit, right? So spirit. And this is two people with human legs. In the beginning, that was a thing. So, beginning, spirit, healthy, lively. That's the word. So, yeah, student, life. Uh, sorry, study, life, student. Uh, beginning, spirit, healthy. So, in the beginning, two people with legs. This guy, uh, Wolverine. Killed Captain Hook, his spirit crushed. Got it. Whatever. <laughs> um, so that, so healthy. Genki, Gen, Ki, Da. There we go. Uh, so, with that business out of the way, let's start with like going through like just uh doing the sum the. Just going through like the um, the conjugation, like I, I've done this in the last stream, but uh, it's again like I'm a review kind of person. I repeat myself over and over again. So, <laughs> um, yeah, it, it, it's just it's, it's it's what I do. So, uh, so yeah, say here a state of being can be implied without using da, right? It's da is just something you just say to emphasize yourself, you know, like sometimes. Eh, it's, it, they, have, they have its uses but yeah it, this is basically saying like uh, you, you you just basically like figure like out whether you're, you're asking a question and answering said question based on your tone alone so this is like genki genki right <laughs> that's literally what, what this guy is trying to say uh, so yeah <clears throat> excuse me uh, so going to the next part here conjugating to the negative state of being so this is what i was talking about uh this is tomo dachi right uh this is a friend i think uh and the thing is i know this character yeah th this is friend i don't even think but the thing is like they have a very sussy kind of like association to this word basically like touching each other's crotches so that's how you express friendship apparently uh just imagine that this is a guy that's a person yeah we've we've established mr t is a person and there's another guy mr t another mr t another person and he's touching his crotch uh apparently that's how that's what friends do in japan you touch each other's crotches so uh yes uh this is you use the Kunyomi reading apparently, um, and uh, for the this one, I think this means accomplished, right? Because it has that. This is a sheep, and it's on a road, right? And a sheep that's under a road is an accomplishment. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, how I know that is because like um if I search for sheep, you see how it looks like that character, right? And um uh, and if I go look for the word road, roadway, right? Like it, it, it's it's kind of like that, right? It's 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 weird how how like it's it's I I I I am looking for meaning on things but yeah it's 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 yeah oh soil soil sorry 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 soil soil is the one I was looking for yeah yeah I see 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 this is soil there's a, uh well, we say a plunge two feet underground well, whatever yeah, yeah the stick ground but yeah that's the stick so basically the sheep. This guy here is under the soil. And a sheep under the soil is an accomplishment. So yeah, it it's it's 
Yeah, so that's how I know that this means accomplished. Because there's a sheep under the soil. And that's the accomplishment. Two friends touching each other's crotches. That's a friend. And this is a sheep. So, tomo. Uh, and you use the, kon the konyomi reading for that. Uh, dachi. Right, so. Uh, I think I think I'm starting to get an, an epiphany here. Um, Okay, so. Why, like, that one has, like, the dash in it. But probably, like, if you're pronunciate, if you're pronouncing something with, if the first kanji is being pronounced in kunyomi, then you follow the next kanji with a kunyomi as well, and you just use this. Probably that's what I'm missing here, because I was like struggling with that. Um, so yeah, tomodachi, um, uh, and genki. We've already covered that. So, uh. In Japanese negative past or expressive conjugation, yeah. Uh, so basically, if you're trying to like say something that's not, you just attach janai. So gakusei janai, or tomodachi janai, or genki janai. Uh, so, uh, that's basically how you say like, no, he's not well, he's not a friend, or he's not a student. So. Conjugating to the past state of being, uh, you basically just say datta. You just you just basically attach datta at the end. So, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So basically, what is so this is the past state of being. You just say you just attach datta there, and the negative past state of being basically saying like he was not um, in English. Uh, this is just saying something is in the past, so you say you just attach data at the end, and for the negative, you just if you're saying he was not or were not, negative past state of being, you just say you just attach a janakata at the end. So basically, this means gakusei data or uh, tomodachi janakata, or this was genki janakata. So. Yeah, that's basically how you say it, right? And yeah, uh, if, so basically this is the summary. So is student genki da? Oh, sorry, no, gakusei da, gakusei datta, gakusei uh, janai, gakusei janakata. So uh, yeah, it's it, it, that's how you just and then you just you know you just use like you know any other noun um, and then apply the conjugation just to determine whether like you're saying something as a, as per, in that particular state or uh, you're saying something in the past or you're saying something that's not or saying something that you know is not but you know was in the previous oh hey robo welcome welcome <laughs> hi 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 yeah, yeah, yeah it's moi just doing my usual thing but I guess I guess before we go through like these, and it's, it's just a review. Um, yeah, but how, yeah, how, how are things, Robo? <coughs> doing fine, doing fine. Like I probably like weird weirded out that I'm doing a weekend review stream on a Thursday evening. <laughs> um, but yeah, I did explain already that um I have a packed schedule on th this weekend, so yeah. Good, good, good. Awesome, nice, nice, nice. Yeah, it's um, I guess this is a good um, kind of segue to. Here we <laughs> This guy here, um, and I should give him a quick shout out. But um, yeah, this guy. I just so like I could just also like test out whether like my um. My bot's working. This, this thing's flaky as hell. There we go, it's working. Holy shit. There was like a moment there. I was like, oh my god, is this thing broken again? Um, But yeah, no, this guy here. Um, <laughs> he's a character. He's a character. He's one of the most unique persons I've met. Uh, uh, wow, that, well, not that I should. Was that right grammar? No, probably not. But um, anyway. Uh yeah yeah it's um 
as you can as already tell like you know he's like also like big into like the cosplay thing and yeah yeah he's like <laughs> I, I, I had the pleasure of like uh meeting and befriending so <laughs> that's okay okay cool <laughs> But yeah, yeah, it's um. I wish I had like something to say along those lines, but no, uh, like uh, my prepared topics, um, uh, learning stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, like that's kind of like the thing about these streams. Um, I'm not really sure if I'm alone here. Maybe I should, maybe I should do a cursory look at Twitch. Actually, you know what? Let's look at Twitch. I don't know whether I'm alone in um. <clears throat> or wow that i i that's just that's me alive live um like am i am i am i the only one doing this con kind of content um Kunio. oh you have you heard of that um uh robo oh there's like other people who oh those are past videos um the practicing japanese language and then mortuary assistant but he's already playing more choices at this point. Okay, so cool. Um, uh, yeah, I. You got me and Princess here, not the right hand chat. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Awesome, awesome. Yeah. No. I, you know, you guys are learning Japanese through me, via osmosis, right? So, <laughs> but yeah, 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 yeah. It's 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 it's. Uh, you know, like. I, yeah, it's it's one of the things I I I set out in my goals. Um, is that I kind of I just want a strong community, like a, a community, like a people who like you know like respect each other, who like each other, and uh, yeah, it's just you know, it's what I do. <laughs> You're making chocolates well dressed up as a. Wait, so you're not only dressed up as a butler. But you are making chocolates whilst dressed as so. That's that's never seen, never seen something like that before. So, or not saying, I don't know why why did I, why did I latch on before there? No, I haven't seen anything like that. But <coughs> sorry, where was I going? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. um, yeah, it's 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 weird that well i don't know like i guess i guess I'm, I'm doing this i'm doing a more intense deep dive into japanese well the well some of these guys are like you know they put japanese into uh as a like a a side i want to say a side i don't that's a, that's a harsh word um they, they're probably learning japanese well but probably like you know they kind of want to game every now and then well, I don't. I'm not a gamer, right? <laughs> no, I'm joking. I am kind of a gamer, but um, yeah, it's it's, it's um, you know, I have um, uh, I have other streams for that. So, uh, while typing to and just sleep, clean the fridge completely, well, and do many windows. <laughs> well, at least at least you're like you know, at least you're be productive, right? Man, like um, you know that that. Yeah, like, like, like I, I, I oftentimes like have to reassure people that um, uh, if you're not uh, that be, and the, the people here like most of the people I'm talking about are other VTubers. Like I would always like reassure them like, uh, and they would be like worried about like oh I'm Stuart I'm not streaming I should be like streaming and stuff like, um, uh, but I have like school and work and family and like windows and um uh, fridges to clean uh you know it's eating up my streaming time and i'm like uh, those three are important right <laughs> well four or five if we're, if we're being technical about this but and i am on the camp that you, you want to prioritize those first before you um, start streaming because um uh, you kind of want to be in a good headspace you kind of want to know that okay chores done like clean the house fed the children um you know like fix the car yeah you know, um uh, 
you know, and uh, that kind of gives you like, you know, a, a moment of Zen, like uh, like clarity in terms of like, oh, you know what? I'm going to be able to do 100% on my streaming tomorrow, right? So, yeah. So, you know, if, if, you're, if you're like, you know, worried, at, oh, no, I'm like, no, I'm not streaming enough because I'm doing my chores. I think it, it, by you doing your chores and like doing kind of like the stuff you need to do, you are actually like preparing for your stream, for your eventual stream, right? So that's my philosophy, you know, probably like people might refute that, but <laughs> anyway, uh, you're learning some, oh, like the Japanese, you mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, um, yeah, it, it, I, I kind of had like um, a goal where like, yeah, like I'm going to go like learn some Japanese, but I want other people to kind of learn with me as well. So hence why like I have this, I had this idea. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Chores give you a, sl a slender, I think a stronger body. So it's just part of my daily workout. Yeah. You know, you got to keep active chat. You got, you got to move. You got to move. You just, you just, you, you just got to move. Because if you live a sedentary lifestyle, you are going to get depressed. You are going to wonder. You're going to have bad thoughts. And uh, that's not good, right? So that's why, like, you know, like, people keep, pe people, like, I probably, probably, like, almost, probably already lame already. But when people say, use, like, touch grass as an insult, uh, th they're not insulting you. They're giving you, like, life advice <laughs> you you have to touch grass chat you have to touch grass commune with nature um be be um around the things that you know where you come from right because that will give you kind of like energy uh, for you to be able to be out there so Robo also has too much energy not to try to wear himself out. Fun fact. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So this guy, this guy here, um, I am always scared of being in a conversation with him. Although I like, I like, I like, I like being with him. I like, I like hang out, hang out with him. However, I do not have the luxury of time <laughs> uh, to like, you know, um, uh, you know, cover all of the energy robo has so sometimes i have to go like okay <laughs> I, I i have to like i have to like all right robo like i have i have to go do my chores <laughs> um but yeah yeah he had a lot of energy so I, I, in a way in some ways i wish i had his energy i like even just like fr a fraction of his energy because oof, it's just it's just just one of those things one of those things <laughs> all right all right, Robo was, Robo was telling me to go back to learning. All right, let's go, let's go back to learning. Okay, 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 okay. All right. So, uh, yeah, uh, going back to, like, the kanji stuff. Yeah, so I'm not going to explain again, once again, like, what kanji is, but it's just a, a way for you to not... It's a way... F but in a, in a nutshell, it's a way for you not to sound like a total child, right? Um because if you only use hiragana and katakana um, when conversing with other Japanese or even like writing something um, to for other Japanese people to consume, I'm not saying I'm Japanese, I'm just saying like, you know, for Japanese, I, I had a slip of tongue there. But um, if you just write or speak in these two alone, you're going to sound like a child because um, there's a lot of words that pretty much have the same sound uh and that's kind of a that's kind of difficult that's why like people say japanese is a contextual language right um i'm not able to like conjure up an example but i think the word for high school in airport is reminiscent of that so let, let, let's 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 um give you an example uh so uh google translate Right? I'm just going to use Google Translate, by the way. I know people are like, you Google Translate. Uh, so airport, koko, right? Uh, even has like that, um, 
that uh, accent on the top of you. But if you go for high school, it's Kokoko. So, uh, I, probably a bad example, but um, it, it, you will you will come across words where hang on, they are literally pronounced the same way, kind of like read and red and red, right? Like from like hearing the words alone without any context, like I read the red book. Like what the hell are we talking <laughs> talking about here? Um, it's the same way. So, and I think in English we just you know we just said like you know f it. <laughs> that's that's a thing now. Like you know, read a red and red are basically like pronounced the same way, but they are totally different. Uh, so we just said, and when people complained about it, like I know, let's screw it. I, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not a walking dictionary. It's the guy who invented or like you know managing English. Um, but to the Japanese, that was a deal break, right? I, we cannot, the Japanese were like in a table, you know, or like in a, in a conference room. They're like, no, 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 This can't be. This can't be. You can, we can't do this to ourselves. Like, oh, we, we need to like set up a way to like, um, you know, like be able to write something different, even though they sound the same, right? So hence why we have this monstrosity right uh, we have we have kanji now so um so yeah that's basically i guess in some ways kind of like a very bastardized history of why we're here uh but yeah going back so yeah mr t person a child um uh, i know it's a child i don't even need to read the kohi story but if you're interested uh, this is a child, right? Uh, a child who is ten with Afra's Ma, right? So you see the ten there? And that's a character for the hiragana or katakana ma. Right? Hence why it's saying katakana ma. Uh, that said, it's, it's already ingrained in my memory that this character is child, so I don't even need to read this. But if you're, yeah, if you're like trying to learn why, uh, a child who is ten was with Afra's Ma. So if you go look for 10 here, that's 10, a cross. So that's 10, and the character at the top looks like a ma, and this is ma, right? That's how, like, people, like, t uh, that's that's what people tell themselves <laughs> uh, whenever they're trying to learn kanji. Like, you know, they're just, they just do word association. And... Uh, it kind of works. I I myself use it, but um, sometimes like I just ingrained it in my head. Like I don't even like play with the whole word association game anymore. Uh, so yeah, that's that's child. Uh, a child who is ten asking for his ma, but that's a child. Small. Uh, this looks like a penguin, and penguins are small. I don't know why. <laughs> uh, Middle, this looks like a mouth that's being bisected in the middle. And how I know that? Because the Japanese, the kanji for mouth is this. It's just a square with a little, with a little protrusion on the bottom, right? So it's a mouth, it's being bisected in the middle. Hence middle. Naka. Or, uh... No, that's mouth. Sorry. Um, if I go for middle, uh, it's just oh Jesus Christ. So sometimes like oh 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 no, I want to click that. Jesus. Sorry, bit of technical difficulties here, chat. Um, uh, middle. In. So uh, naka. So if you're saying something like alone uh, on its own, like. Uh, in, uh, it's naka here, so yeah, and big, uh, basically Mr. T with his hands outstretched, right? So it's a person, big per, uh, Mr. T being a being a big person. Oh, Mr. T with his hands outstretched like that. I I know I'm not. Does it look like I'm like stretching out my hands? But, um, 
yeah, like with his hands outstretched like that. Uh, I'm gonna show you Mr. T, by the way. I'm not sure. I keep I keep talking about Mr. T. I should probably like um give him a little uh, picture here. Yeah, so this is Mr. T, and um, you're probably <laughs> wondering if you're coming into Japanese class and you're wondering why am I showing Mr. T. Uh, yes, apparently Mr. T is a thing in Japanese language um, learning sessions. Uh, yeah, so if you see Mr. T is a big guy, and if he has his hands outstretched like that, then that must mean he, he's, he's bigger. He's big. So hence why uh, this character is big. Right? Again, I will show you. I will show you. Like, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, joking around here like this is this is mr t um a person stretching out like the scarab airway so a person yeah this one showing himself larger widening his arms if i go back to to the person thing once more it's mr t <laughs> right so yeah it's it's it, it, it's it's i don't know it's it's weird but on its own you say oh uh but if it's paired with another kanji it's it's uh dai or tai right uh that's why like funny enough tai dai chi yeah, yeah, yeah a lot of if if you um watch if you, if you're familiar with some anime and if you come across some characters who are big or strong they usually have dai or tai in their names because it's uh, uh, I've come to know that a lot of Japanese, a lot of like, uh, mangakas aren't really that like creative with their names. <laughs> so, uh, uh, yeah, yeah, it, it, it's, 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 it's learning Japanese is basically an exercise of dispelling like these, like, uh, these, um, uh, these nice visions of what Japanese society and anime looks like, right? Because now I know, like, yeah, like a lot, like not people, not a lot of the anime I read and watch, you know, they're not really that creative, at least in the naming part. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, yeah that's that's a, that's the thing. So, um, uh, so this is friend, yeah. I, we've already talked about that. Study, yeah. School. Hi. Uh, yeah, that's the tree and mingling school. Uh, that's hi. Oh, yeah. Two aliens. Yeah. Together. Uh, okay. I'm kind of curious. Like, well, what, what's the, um, what's the, so school? So, oh, I want to, I want to click on you. Oh, actually, coming in that, yeah, yeah. On. Uh, yo. No. Wait, sorry. Ah, oh, sh. Yeah, cool. Cool. And tall, high, uh, takai. Taka. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Cool. Yeah, 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 so it's it's, it's using it's using like um, so, yeah, that's 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 the, yeah, so two aliens standing on top of each other to look tall. Um, so if I go here, and type in hi. Um, I should just search this here. Sometimes like oh tall, it uses tall. So yeah, takai, yeah. And car is basically kuruma. Uh, actually, if I go for on, that's uh, sha. Right? Yeah, that's sha. Kuruma. Okay. Yeah, um, car basically is like uh, some guy going through 10 rice fields. And you need a car for that. So, yeah. Uh accompanying I, f I kind of probably like uh compounds practical strokes uh 
company submit to get oh okay okay, okay yeah okay okay so th th apparently like this gsho thing is actually kind of helpful but um we'll, we'll continue to work with this um thing um this rtk this uh, kanji database but uh yeah so submit this is the character for together so mr t this guy submits a resume together this is a, this is the character for together yeah so and reach reach is what accomplished i think so yeah, yeah, yeah. oh okay so that was like the friend thing yeah, yeah, yeah. so if you see, go back to here Tomodachi, Tachi, yeah, friend. Okay. Uh, and vocabulary. So, yeah, um, I covered this in the last stream. Uh, basically, some basic vocabulary here. Um, I know, like, uh, you've heard in some anime, they say hi for yes. But um, I also know, like, you can also say just say mm. You must have heard, you must have like watched some anime where like the character was like not necessarily like you know enthusiastic about something, but if but when pressed to like respond positively about something, they would just say mm. right. That's that's the, this is what's happening here, mm. <laughs> and uh, it it's kind of so slightly like annoying, but the the. The casual way of saying no in Japanese is, is not not ie or nai, but uh, mm, mm, mm. Right, like uh, I'm doing like a head shake as well, just to kind of add some context. Mm. Right, so yeah, it it it's it's subtle, but uh, that's a thing. And this kore, sore, are. Right, so this, sore, uh, sorry, kore, sore, are. Right, so this, that, that over there. So that's why you say kore when you're talking to someone close. You say you say sore when you're trying to pertain to some. You're pointing to something, you know, not necessarily too far, but you know, not necessarily like within like speaking distance. Uh, and you say are when you like are pointing to something very far away. So uh yeah. A nice little like um uh help helper words, I guess, if you will. Uh to learn. So mm, mm, mm. or mm. Uh, mm, mm for yes. Mm. For no. Uh kore sore are this, that, that over there. Uh and a uh, person is hito adult is otona okay so um i know it's kind of weird i just had a whole spiel about like using onyomi readings for this but apparently this you use the kunyomi readings for adult um this is basically big person right um so big person otona right uh going back to the rtk uh, big guy here, large, and adult. Uh, sorry, a person. And we're not using the onyomi reading here. We're using the um, the kunyomi. So oton oton otona. Uh, o to o no. Oh, I guess the na is kind of missing, but apparently just, I guess on it says otona. Otona? Okay, cool, 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 cool. And this is child, so basically, um, so this, this is a child, and this is saying an actual child, accomplished, right? Um... We go back to the RTK here. Submit. Oh. What was I accomplishing? Oh, accompanying. Oh, yeah, 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 accompanying. So, this is child. 
yeah i guess i guess um for this particular example like you can also like say child like like so so um cool oh, so it's using the, the kunyomi reading as well here so ko kodomo so that's and then submit um yeah that's mo that's domo oh yeah this one kodomo yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. So here and there. Okay, 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 cool, 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 cool. Kodomo. And friend is, of course, Tomodachi. Here we go. Kuruma. Mm, Gakusei. Sensei. So, Sensei, um, that's new kanji right there. Um, this is basically someone being, this is the kanji for a head. Um, going back to like, uh, the other kanji that looks similar, this one, this is beginning. So two people who walk on legs. That was in the in the beginning. So you see how like um they're slightly similar, but different here. So again, two leg, two legs. Um, uh, and if I look this up in the kanji database, this is before. So, I, I never seen a cow with human legs before. So, um, uh, yeah, it's like. But, I guess the the be the best way to kind of like um look this up, as well. Uh, so was that before? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Is um, actually no. You know what? Let's 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 not use the word before because I, I uh, this can also be construed as the word ahead, like a h e a d. So um, this is ahead and this is life. So if you're ahead in life, you are a sensei, a teacher, right? So and how like how did the cow happen there? Um, uh, I've seen a cow with human legs before. So yeah, basically if you go search for cow. That's it, right? You see a cow. You see that? That's a cow right there, but without the legs. So, if you see a cow with human legs, that cow's been that, that cow's a head. It's a head, or never seen a cow before, and before is a head. So a head in life, oh. or a head. And if you're a head in life, that's life there. That's you're a teacher, you're a sensei. Um, and school is um that's a student, and mingling. So that's uh gakko, right? Uh that's ga sokuon ho. So with the sokuon basically you just add another you just with feeling we um just pronounce the k very hard. So gakko. Um and elementary school that's small guy, small a child and school so small child school means an elementary school and how you pronounce that is shogaku or shogaku not shu a sho shogaku so um sho ga ko and shogaku uh and uh middle school is uh this is middle right another child and school so middle, child, school, middle school. And that's pronounced chugaku. So chu, uh, chu, uh, chugaku. So you see how like it's pronouncing two U's here? So chugaku. And you just say the gaku there. And high school, it, that's where this is where things started to like uh, move away from what we were what we were like on here. You see how like there's like small. You got your middle, and you must have been expecting the big guy, right? The tai. But no, in high school, you just go for the tall, and then school. So the child vanished. So basically, once, sorry. <clears throat> uh, once you have moved away from middle school and entered high school, you are no longer considered as a child in Japanese society. Hence why there's no child here in high school. 
This is Taiga. This is Koko. Koko. Right? And if we go back to the RTK, or at least let's go back to like these guys there. So Little, it's going to use. Yeah. It's going to use like the Onyomi reading here. So Sho, that's Sho right there. Sho, and um, we know that uh, this guy, child, uh, will use the Ga. Uh, or no. Sho, Ga. Oh wait, hang on. Let me just get the on um, the school exam. Uh okay, cool. Yeah, shoga, cool. So we got child. Hmm. Wait, hang on. I guess, I guess, okay, that's slightly weird, that's slightly weird to be out, but anyway, um, yeah, so, that's sho, ga, ko, so this is, oh, ah, I see now, I see now, I see now, I see now, exam, child, Ga. I don't see the ga here. Ga here is, yeah. Oh, I see now. I see now. Little. Okay, okay, okay. It's it's probably it's like um, yeah. It you add here. Oh, the sokon. Ah. Oh, I see now. I see now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is cool. But with the soak, because there's a soak one. Yeah, okay, cool. Oh, so guys being used as a. Okay, 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 cool, cool, cool. I had an epiphany. Um, probably like not able to like um explain it. Um, but uh, as long as yeah, but you gotta have to trust me that this is. Ga ko, with the soak one there that's pertaining to the child, and it's using the kunyomi reading for that. Uh. Apparently, like, yeah, um, you get to use the Onyomi there, Kunyomi here, and this one is the, uh, the on well, you only use Onyomi, but yeah, uh, this is cool. Yeah. Well, this one's cool, I think. Oh, yeah, 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 it's cool, yeah. Yeah. So, uh, middle school, Chugaku. Ch ch sorry, Chujak, Chujak. Uh, sorry, Chugaku. Uh, so, Chu there. So if you go check for the kanji for it, no. All right, I'm gonna have to go like give it a little something, something here. So uh, yeah, it's using the on onyomi Chu, and then Gaku, right? And for high school. That's two aliens there. And if we go grab the 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 kanji for tall, uh it's gonna say it's gonna use the ko for onyomi. And since we're both combining the two onyomi kanji together, we're gonna go do the onyomi reading for for school as well. Uh, for school as well. So that's why it's that's why this is pronounced koko. Or Coco, yeah. And uh, for college, this is Taigaku. Uh, because this is, again, we, we keep using the study um, symbol. And so I, the, the Gaku is starting to like get drilled into my head. So this is Taigaku. So Tai, Tai Gaku. Uh, this is the, uh, the symbol for Ku. So 
if we go back to the big guy here, tall, uh, big, uh, RTK, hello, um, uh, large. See, it's, 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 it, this is Tai. So, Tai Gakko. Well, that's Dai. Uh, this is Tai. Oh, no, sorry, Dai Gakko. No, 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 sorry. Okay, um, a little bit of misinformation there, sorry. But yeah, this is Dai Gakko. Dai, 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 Delta. D is in Delta. Dai Gakko. I, I, I'm blind. I can't see the, the Dakuten. Yeah, so it's using this. Dai Gakko. So, yeah, college. And, yeah, it, it's, 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 um, You start kind of like, uh, you start getting the reasons for why this is the they are being written in such a way. Again, as I said before, um, uh, elementary school small child, or small s student, sorry, small student school. And um, or small study school. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. this is the character for study. Sorry, small study school. Study is gakko. Um, and well, manabu, manabu. If you're like um saying it alone. Uh, this is uh in middle middle study school middle school. And the, the the study goes away. You just go tall school. So high school. And um, this is basically big study. Um, so yeah, apparently you don't study here. You just, in high school, you're expected to not study, but mingle with other high schoolers. Hence why there's no study. So like, yeah. In the course of a young Japanese person's life, uh, elementary, middle school, and college study. High school, you do not study. You you just be a socialist. You can be probably the reason why, like in a lot of anime, uh, it's mostly a bunch of high schoolers <laughs> because you you really can't like produce a lot of like content or like uh, produce a lot of story or like uh, uh you can't really like drop uh. To like draw up like a, a, a an interesting story about studying hence why like I think people are just gonna go oh, you know what let's just go and like go for high schoolers when, whenever it comes to like you know like drawing up like an anime or a manga hence why yeah you see you see what I'm, you see what I'm getting here like you, once you learn the con or like the words the vocabulary, and the and the kanji within those words, you start seeing meanings as to why they're constructed that way. It's not unlike English, where it's like it's just a bunch of symbols put together, and based on how why they're put together, you start you understand what they are. It's simpler, yes, I'd rather have that, but um, it kanji. When you put two symbols together, and then you mix, and then you compare those sim those combinations with those other combinations, uh, you start realizing, okay, oh, that's the reason why like people have this idea, what that word is in relation to that word, right? So, um, and this is what I was talking about, the whole like elementary, middle, high school, and college thing. So yeah, that's a lot of like vocabulary like covered and i guess um just to before we get to the exercise i'm gonna go and like <clears throat> i'll talk about like a little something i kind of want to like bring up uh so <laughs> i um not sure if you guys realized but i seem to be very animated not sure like super animated but well, I am animated. <laughs> wow. Okay. Um. Yeah. Um. I, I suddenly had a had a strong wave of self awareness wash over me there. Um. I I I, I guess like I I um like 
pretty like involved i guess like um when it comes to a certain genre of video games <coughs> the water will help um uh, get this along yeah and um yeah i've been playing basically like yeah there's this genre of video games that i seem to be like i don't know I'm not I'm kind of like working well with, um, and that's the uh, this game, right? Uh, let me just like uh, lower the volume for a moment here. Oh, oh yeah, audio. I'm not gonna try again. Paper plays. And I will play the music. I like. Yeah. <laughs> A bit too loud, but I'll. Yeah, I've been playing. I, I, I played this game, what? On a Sunday? Uh. Was it a Sunday? I, for, I, I forgot. You know what? Let me, let me, let me, let me look it up. Um. Oh yeah, I, I played this on, I played this on last Sunday, uh, in place of this was like a a Plan B game because of my scheduling issue uh, for the Divinity stream, which is by the way gonna happen in the next couple of days, uh, this Saturday. So yeah, go catch us there. Um, I think my it's gonna it's gonna happen around 4 p.m. Eastern Standard. Uh, that'll be like also 1 p.m. Pacific Standard. Uh, and then for Europe people, that'll be <coughs> about 4 plus 5, 9 p.m. up to like 11 p.m. as you go further east in Europe. And yeah, so going back, sorry, um, yeah, I was playing this game like last Sunday, and uh, I don't know, I guess I was like, I, I kind of got into the whole character thing. Oh, hello, streamer Roos, uh. I know, I know that last word. That's tovarish, right? But I don't know the first one. But, <laughs> but yeah, welcome, welcome, welcome to the stream. Welcome to the stream. Yeah, I was like, I was explaining to chat about, um, uh. So uh, yeah, I'm I'm learning Japanese right now. But this is kind of like my thing where like, all right, I know people like sometimes like whenever they're studying about something, you know, they they get burnt out after like an intense like an hour session so i just talk like something totally different um uh to kind of like you know like get it's kind of like you know just refresh things so I mean, i'm talking about like uh last my last stream which was papers please and uh, yeah I, I think i should just bring up the my twitch there for a moment um no not oh I, I can't i can't play like the video eh can you send links to this chat uh uh sure but uh, hopefully they're hopefully they're they're okay um i'm not sure if i pronouncing the name right strime russ hopefully they're 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 nice links <laughs> um but yeah what, what, what do you want to show us yeah, so, uh, yeah, uh, uh, and I think I played another game of this caliber. Uh, I think it was called Contraband Police. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah, I think I played this, what, like, three months ago? Two months ago? And, yeah, just like Papers, Please, like... You know, there's a whole concept of like going through like a person's application, just being detail oriented, and you know, passing judgment based on a particular assessment done on said application. And I don't know, I get into character, and that's kind of also a reason why like I that it's me, right? I'm a security guard, right? Like, I do like I do like. The aspect of like being detail oriented 
and um, just like playing char playing a character. Um, this mini movie based on the game Papers Please. It has subtitles. Um, okay, let me just verify this for a moment. Ah! Yeah! Okay, 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 cool, 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 cool. Yeah, this is safe, this is safe. Um, is, that, is that playing? Is that playing? Hello? Oh, no, it's not playing. Uh-oh. Play. Sorry, I'm, I'm kind of like slightly like, like. Oh, this is the street. Uh, let's head on back. Uh, that's 95 seconds. Yeah, I, 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 I've been meaning to watch this. Never, never did. Но чтобы не произошло, это должно случиться именно сегодня. Oh, crap. Um, понимаешь? Subtitles are kind of scrunched up. Hang on. В любом uh, случае, я твой должник. Theater mode? That's... Манипуха. Хорошо потрудиться во благо Родины, инспектор! И вам офисы. <laughs> Следующий. Yeah, this is me. This was me. This was me. Like, um... Although, yeah, I, I don't speak Russian, but... Uh... Wait, are you guys hearing this? Like... Oh, yeah. Work. Continuation. Oh. Right. Uh, uh. oh, thank you for follow stream. Uh, sorry. Uh, sorry. Uh, hopefully I'm, I'm pronouncing your name right there. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, I did that. <laughs> well, to be honest, like a lot of players, uh, well, a lot of like, I guess streamers and VTubers who play this game. <laughs> well, green eyes. Okay. Yeah, yeah, a lot, a lot of, a lot of people who play this game, like they go on a very sadistic streak. I think, like, but then again, I'm, I'm, I'm I, you kind of need to because I think there's like a, 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 me a mechanic there where, like, um, uh, if you detain a lot of people, you get rewarded bonuses. So simple infractions like, you know, like an expired document or, um, what, I guess, or like a, 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 or, or a missing or an actual missing document, you can detain them, right? So, which in a normal border, um, you know, assessment scenario, you're, you're not, you're not. That, that that's not that's not grounds for you getting thrown into jail. You're just gonna get sent back. So, yeah, it's it's, it's in a way, there's like a whole power tripping thing going on. But funny enough, this reminds me. Um, there were cosplayers I think who did who um cosplayed as like the border officer for Ostotska. I think that's Papers Please cosplay. Oh, no, 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 it was it was even a YouTube video. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. It's funny, like I, I... <laughs> yeah, yeah, this guy. Oops. Oh, Damn it. Sit down. 
<laughs> You're just asking random questions. <laughs> he just asks people if they're if they're bronies or not. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it's, but yeah, yeah. Thank you for the follow stream. Uh, yeah, I uh, yeah, that video game like, I don't know, like it's 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 a fairly simple. It has a fairly simple like mechanic. Um, as in, yeah, you just again, you just play as a border officer, right? And uh, yeah, like the the detail oriented games. Although, you know, some people may find it like, you know, um, uh, tedious. I guess. Uh, it's actually kind of like relaxing. Like you know, like you know, like you're just working with this particular these particular parameters, and um, you just let the day go by, right? And the same thing with this game here, uh, Contraband Police, right? Um, but I, but I don't recall like being on the other end of this. Um, exchange. I I, w I was the border officer, not the guy being like assessed. Oh, uh, uh, oopsies! I probably need to. Do I like. Nope. <laughs> uh, yeah. So. It it it's it's basically the same thing. Like it, people would say, like this is just papers, please, three D. And uh, yeah, it it's I, I I find like you know like uh these games or simulators, if you will, are like like the thing that might I might I might go I might come back every now and then if I'm if I don't have like. Uh, people to collab to, like start to collab with, more if like if I just ran out of like backlog games. So yeah, um, expect maybe a maybe like a simulator or two. Um, whether it could be Euro Truck, uh, which I still have to invest in the driving in some driving gear for that, or um, I don't know, or gas station simulator. I only kind of want again, like I, I this this is this is just me like. I don't know. I don't know what my what my obsession with these games are. Like, do you see? You see this chat? You see, you see this? Like, I. <laughs> just, I I want to play this game, but look, I'm sweeping a floor. I'm... <laughs> I. Don't, I don't. I don't know what's wrong with me. Um. Again, like. I guess like people will probably like say, oh, well, why don't you play Valorant or like why won't you play League? And I'm like, I don't know. It, it just it, 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 those games just don't speak. Uh, oh, by the way, about the pronunciation of your nickname. Oh, that's your nickname. Uh, it is just pasted into Google Translate. Oh, really? Okay, let's let's, let's try it out. Uh. All right, all right. Uh, translate. Uh, Google. Hello, can I type? Um. Uh, that'll be Russian, right? I know that's. Streamerus. Streamerus. Probably streamerus, not streamerus. I've never heard, like a Russian say like, the um. You use like this. You like say something like try or something. It's streamerus, right? I think so. I think so. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. The Google Translate like not really the best translator. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Anyway. Anyway. Like uh, yeah. I um. Funny enough. Like yeah. I um. 
this is funny like yeah i i um no, i appreciate you got you like um spending time here um streamers but i have to like also note that i get a lot of like uh people from europe with my viewers so <laughs> so yeah it, it's it's doubly like uh uh not very confusing but i feel very very bad that uh i'm keeping people awake <laughs> uh whenever i stream because i usually stream around these times so but then again maybe maybe that, that's my that's my market right like i um uh i i i, I get like the people who can't seem to like go to bed in europe <laughs> uh yeah you know that's a fun mar that's a, that's an untapped market I think so. I, I think I think I think that's a, I think that's a fair statement to make. So uh, yeah, but yeah, no. Um, going back, yeah. Um, if I ever am in a position where like I don't have any games to play, or the schedule is all, I I, I had a scheduling boo boo. I would probably like fork the eighteen dollars here. And then play Gas Station Simulator. Funny enough, another simulator I probably want to try as well is this. And I'm like, wait, this is like 80 bucks. Air Traffic Simulator. Oh my god, look at this. Look at this, Jed. Look at this. Like, this is, this is proper, like... Serious stuff we're, we're, we're seeing here. Um, I am literally an air traffic controller in Narita or Haneda Airport, and I am directing these planes to land in airstrips and taking off from said airstrips. Look at this! Like, I don't know, I don't know what, why this is fascinating. Or, or my English bad. Um, fascinating to me. Um. It just is, but yeah, no. the 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 not, the not fascinating part of this though is like it's like eighty dollars, so mm, probably a bad idea to like um, splurge, <coughs> at least in this junction. But yeah, th that's kind of like one thing I wanted to talk about, um, and uh, I guess in relation to that, um, uh, I also want to to play some driving games so that will necessitate me like looking for like uh i forgot i forgot what they're i forgot what they're called nor like what kind of package i should be looking into like you know how like they have a driving wheel and um what else what else a uh oh sorry i uh my bgm Uh, what was that? What was it going? The driving wheel and pedals for PC. Ah, there we go. There we go. There we go. Yeah, I play with PC. Oh my goodness. Again, it's my lore, right? So it's a Japanese psychological horror. Right. And yeah, I basically play my job. <laughs> The thing is, it's a it's a horror game, and I do want to like let people know that I am actually very very like into horror games. And when I say that, I'm in. I say that along the lines of like I, I do tend to scare myself. Like I I, I really get into these horror games to the point that like I, my my heart will actually skip. And, you know, I, I want people to know that I'm not joking, <laughs> right? And then I, so, yeah, I, I'm going to go invest in a heart beat heart rate monitor. I think you've already seen this game from one YouTuber. Yeah, it, it's a fairly common, like, video game played by other VTubers and YouTubers, I guess, for that matter. Um... But yeah, it's 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 it's. I want I want to do this right because I played Five Nights at Freddy's and 
both one and two. By the way, I'd rather play one compared to two because two is actually a very tedious like sequel of the original. It it became more of a skill. It made, it became more of a, a test of reflexes rather than like, you know, a horror game. And yeah, when when I was playing those like games, I was like, you know, I was scared. I was scared. Um, I was telling chat like, you know, I'm not joking. I'm actually I'm actually somewhat catatonic now. And they were not having they were having none of it. And so, to put that matter to rest. I'm gonna before I go and play this game, I'm gonna go buy a heart beat heart rate monitor, hook it up to my gaming rig here, and stream the game. Because yeah, like that way, like you know, I'm not. I can tell people. I that way, I can like actually show to people that yeah, I am scared. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. Being, I'm not. I'm not doing an act here, <laughs> right? I like. I like horror games in that. In that. In in that vein, right? Like I like getting scared, uh, but I, but at the same time, I hate it because it hurts. It hurts me physically. Like my heart can't take it, <laughs> right? So, um, uh, it's kind of like it's kind of like uh, it's kind of like alcohol in some in some regards, or if you like if you look hard enough. But yeah, it's uh. Uh, I I have I have to get to that, you know. It's it's something that, you know, I've been putting off, uh, but I really should get to that. So, okay, um, that should be, uh, good. That should be a good distraction. Let's let's start with like the exercise with the conjugation in the or in our first grammatical structure in Japanese. <clears throat> so um, yeah, again. Um, stream like I, I'm actually like learning Japanese in this um, stream so uh, and basically I'm at, the, I'm at that point where I'm being asked to like test out kind of like what I've learned so far so this is kore and uh, we are now going to practice the state of being of conjunctions or take each noun and conjugate it to the following forms so declarative wait hang on kore yeah, got it. Uh, de declarative, negative state of being, past state of being, negatives past state of being. So this is exam. This is the sample here. He told uh, excuse me. Uh, uh, he told Janai. Uh, uh, he told datta. Uh, he told Janakata. And so basically for here, oh, I can't type, what? Oh, I guess I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't write it. Okay, so this is basically like, you know what? Maybe I can, oh, I, I didn't expect this. It's kind of a bad, like, um, let me, let me um open up something here. I, I don't know. All right, stream. All right, thanks for uh, thanks for stopping by. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks, thanks for showing me like the papers, please thing. Yeah, yeah I will, will, will want to watch it though. But I never really had, uh, never was able to like find the time. So anyway, well, thank you for again. Thank you for stopping by. Um, uh, yeah. So d I probably should like. All right, let me fashion something here, chat. Uh. Open up a window. Hmm. A window capture. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so let me um open up a notepad here. Um. Window capture. Yeah. Yeah, notepad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool, 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 cool. There you go. There you go. Right, right, right. Kind of works, eh? So if I let's say um, go back to that, uh, right? Okay, okay, okay. And if I type it here, yep. Uh, I guess if I like increase the the font a little bit, yep. 
right? Should work. All right, all right, all right. We're cooking with gas now. So, um, let me just take this out. Get in my um, get a gun of there, and we should be ready to cook. So yeah. So basically, declarative for kore. Um, kore da. Right, that's kore da. And negative, kore janai. Right. Kore janai. Oh, maybe like. Oh, no, 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 no. Kore janai. Okay, cool, 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 cool. It's slightly screwy, but. Uh, the past. Uh, kore datta. Kore datta. Yeah. Okay. And negative past. Kore janakata. Kore janakata. Right. So. Janakata. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that, that works. Yep, 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 yep. So basically, um, this is it. This is this, this, this. It's this. This is not. Um, it was, or this was. This was, and this was not. Yeah. So if I like translate this as such, going back to the English. Um, this is. Right and, um. Uh, negative. This isn't. Right. Uh, and this one. Uh, past. It's. This was. This was. This was. I think. And, uh, this was. This was. This wasn't, or this was not. So. Uh,これだ.Uh,これじゃない.Uh,これだった.And,これじゃなかった. Uh, uh, right? So that's how it works. Uh, the next one, declarative. Um, this is. Let me let me line it up. Can I line it up? Hello. That's screwy. I'm like, I'm like doing this exercise to line up the notepad and the browser together. Too far. There you go. And we go back here. That's um, otona. Okay. Uh, uh, otona da. Going back to the Japanese keyboard. Uh, otona da. That's why I'm caps locking this. Um, otona da. Otona da. Oh wait, but I can like. Yeah, yeah, yeah this one. There you go. Otona da. This is yeah. You, you, you saw what I did there. Like I basically like wrote the hiragana equivalent, and then since I know what I was trying to say there, I want to say adult. I just look for. I just went for the kanji. Uh, this one. A uh, negative. Uh, otona janai. Otona janai. Uh, this one. See, otona janai. And this one, otona datta. Otona datta. Yeah, so what, what, what I'm showing to you guys, like, this is how, like, this is what the Japanese re really do when they're typing in, like, or where, like, if they're, like, writing something over the internet. They literally just use hiragana and kata katakana to write what they want to say. 
and then they just scroll through the 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 choices that the Windows guy like um thinks what they're trying to say. I'm not sure what doing what they're doing, right? So, in some ways, this is a much much practical way of learning Japanese, given that um. Not that, I think uh, this is this is the same thing with English, right? I don't, I don't, I think a lot of us have forgotten how to write stuff with a pen, <laughs> and uh, yeah, we just basically like type English as opposed to like write them with a with a pen. Um, and it's the same thing with Japanese; they just type things now. Um, so for example, like um, negative past for otona. Uh, otona janakata. Uh, otona janakata. And there you go. So you you saw the hiragana I I, I typed there, but um but I know that I wanted to see adult. So I just went okay. I'll just go with like the kanji for adult there because I don't want to be misunderstood. Because if I just typed in like otona, um, if I if I type it like this, right? Otona janakata, or sorry, otona janakata, like that. Uh, this could be mis this could be misunderstood because there could there could pro there could be a chance where like in Japanese this could mean a different thing, right? That's why like people will want you to use kanji because from here, otona means adult, right? So that is the reason why people, in, in some ways, that's the reason why kanji still exists. Because yeah, that's how this, the that's how it works. So, uh, is basically an as oh sorry, um, go back to the English keyboard there. Uh, this is a, is an adult. Um. Uh. Otona uh, Janai is not an adult. Is not an adult. It's not an adult. I guess we say it's not adult. It's not now. I would say an adult. An, an adult. An adult. Yeah. It's a noun, right? I'm just making it like um, digestible to English speakers. Um, this was uh, Otona Otona Datta uh, was an adult. So so. I guess. What what's what what's beyond being an adult? <laughs> I thought adult was like the end game. Um, and this is uh Otona Janakata. Uh was this was not an adult. It's probably maybe like you you're in a crime scene. Apparently the uh the person who committed they, they thought it was an adult at first but no it was like a not it was like a child who committed a crime or something so yeah you would say it like this otona uh, janakata yeah so that's the conjugation for that and we'll go to the next one uh, if i can scroll down hello Okay, I think that's enough. Uh, next one is this is uh what is this? Ah, gakko. This is a uh, school, basically. Uh, so this word here, this is gakko. So it took me a while, but uh, yeah, you see, you see, like you're starting to, I started to kind of like just understand the words now. So uh, let's head back to our Japanese keyboard, and uh, let's get cracking, eh? Okay? Uh, gakko. Uh, gakko da. So is he? That's it. No, 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 no. Eh? Oh. Oh wait, maybe I maybe I'm 
Maybe maybe I'm screwing up. Hang on. Let me um No, that's that's how it's pronounced though. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Let me um. I'm starting starting to doubt myself now. Um. So, kakoda. Kakoda yo. Why why is there like kakoda? All right. I'm 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 gonna look for the. I'm gonna toggle the answers, but I'm not gonna look for. Uh, I'm just gonna like. Okay. Kakoda. Oh, okay. So, all right. I didn't look at the. I did look at the other answers. Eh, by the way, chat. But um, yeah. It, it apparently like um sometimes like Windows won't give you the right stuff, right? So um, you just have to like trust your gut, <laughs> or at least like use Windows. As, like okay, uh, he was able. To, Windows was able to like figure out what I wanted to say, at some like fifty percent. So and you have to kind of like um refine whatever windows spat at you so which is you know yeah it is again it is a normal thing a normal thing a lot of japanese people like uh, uh, japanese speakers do this so do not worry about looking like a a noob when you're when um when you come across this kind of problem so yeah it's gakoda right and uh this one is gakko janai Uh, there you go. See, so a Windows was able to figure exactly what I wanted to say. Gakko janai. And um, this one is gakko datta. Yep, check it out. Study, school, datta. And this one is gakko janakata. Ko ja nakata. Right? So if we're gonna translate this in English, this is gonna be uh sorry, I I, I blanked out for a second there. Um uh is school oh sorry. <laughs> Go back to the English keyboard, Stuart. Is school um cool this is i keep blanking out now hang on hang on hang on hang on um it's cool uh it's not a school it's not a school or is a school? Let's say it's a school. It's still like it's palatable to an English audience. Um, was a school, and was not a school. There you go. Oh, it just it just occurred to me. Like I'm actually like slightly. Um. No, that that didn't that at all. Um. No, it's like. There you go. You just notice, like, um, yeah, like the 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 notepad was like edging out there. Um. Okay, so going back to uh, the exercise here. So yeah. There you go. All right. Next one is this guy. But but am, am I am I am I am I getting through? Am I am I am I like you know? Hopefully hopefully like you guys are like learning. Right, so because I am. <laughs> uh, so Japanese. Okay, cool. Um, and this number here is tomodachi, friend, an accomplished friend because tomo. Their friend and dachi is um, accomplished. Apparently, like that's how they say best friend. And uh, yeah, for this exercise, we're gonna go to the whole conjugation thing once more. 
友達だ。If I can type hello? 友達だ。Yep. Yeah, just, again, you just have to like get it. You just have to understand the conjugations so that you can actually like figure out what, what to pick when what window spits at you. So, uh, 友達じゃない There you go. Uh, 友達だった Okay, that's all for one there. And, uh, 友達じゃなかった Yep. And again, you're going to already expect what, to, what am I going to say here? All right, I'm going to type here. Is a friend. Um, is not a friend. Um, or was a friend. Ouch. Ouch. Tomodachi <laughs> datta. Um, or was not a friend. Oh, there you go. It's not a friend. There you go. So that's how you say is a friend. Uh, not a friend. Uh, was a friend. Uh, was not a friend. So, yeah. Uh, we move on to the next one. It, it, it's it it it's kind of easy, right? Uh oh, raise up, raise up. Uh, and this one is, gakuse, uh, student, study life. Right. Um. So for this one, we go back to the Japanese keyboard. Hello. Uh, and Gakuseida. Uh, what the fuck? No, Gaku Gaku Se Da. All right, I'm going to toggle the answer. I am right. Yeah. Uh, yeah, sometimes sometimes Windows is like throwing me off. But yeah, just trust your heart. Trust your um intuition whenever you're t using the IME. Uh and you will come out you will come out alive. <laughs> so, um that's Gakuseda. Oh, sorry. That's that's all in um Hiragana. Not going to talk like a baby there. Um Kakuseda. Uh, yeah, just 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 grab like the kanji. Uh, okay, this kanji I want. I'm gonna go for da. There you go. <laughs> A little bodging. Never hurt anyone. Um, kakuse janai. There you go. This this time, like um, Windows was able to figure out what the hell I wanted to say. Gakuse um, datta. Same thing here. And gakuse um, janakata. Janakata. Christ, it's a it's a mouthful. Or maybe like even the type. Gakuse. Uh, Janakata. Yeah. Again. Basically is um uh, is a student. Kakuseda uh is not a student. Kakuse Janai uh, was a uh, was a student. Uh, and um, was not a student. Uh, so, yeah. 
if you toggle the answers, it's roughly similar to what I just typed or pretty much what I typed. I didn't say it's roughly similar, but yeah. Why did I say that? Uh, I should be more like, um, uh, uh, what do you call this? Confident about this. Um, all right, next exercise here. In this second exercise, we're really going to test our conjugation knowledge as well as the vocabulary. We're translating some simple English sentences. Please note that while the positive non past state of being can be implied for the purpose of this exercise, we also use always declaratory. Don't forget that. This creates a very firm and declared. Don't forget that. Oh, okay, 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 cool, cool, cool. Yeah, sometimes. So, again, uh, if you recall, you don't need to add the da at the end whenever you have to say that something is is. Wow, that's so bad. Uh, but, yeah, it, uh, um, because you're going to sound like a bit of a, a jerk, right? It's like you're shouting, like, you know, I'm a student or I'm fine, right? Like, kind of, that kind of, like, deal, so. But for, again, what he's trying to say here is like, just, 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 this is just an exercise. Just, you can use the declar the declaratory tone here. Um, so, is student, gakuseida. Right, so is college, oh, is college, if you recall, chat, if you recall, is college is, if you know the word for college. Is it taigaku? If I can like arrange my, if I can get my, it's kind of a bit weird. Hang on, give me a moment here, chat. I my my OCD is acting up. Nope. Hey yo. Uh. Oh, okay. I think I think we got a winner here. Winner, 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 winner. Uh, cool, 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 cool. All right. So back to the drawing board. Uh, okay. Uh, Japanese, if you please. Thank you. Um, is a college. Taigakuda. Taigakuda. Uh, Taigakuda. Hmm. Oh, no, 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 not Tai. Dai. This doesn't look right. Let me let me go back to like the um. You know what? Let me let me open another like window of that because I I don't think we're gonna. Or at least like let's open a new tab. Um. I don't want to ruin. Did I did I forget my kanji there? Taigaku. Oh, I see now. I see my problem. No, I shouldn't be like doing a double K and that that with the O. Taigaku. Or Taigaku. Taigaku. Oh sorry, Daigaku. 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 Okay, 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 cool. My my mistake, my mistake. Um, so going back here, um, uh, if I type, uh, this here, college is daigaku, daigaku, daigaku da, is college. Oh, dude, that, that sounded pretty cool. Uh, daigaku da. Oh, well, yeah. Daigakura. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So, yeah, um, Windows is, like, preempting the whole... No, don't you don't want to use a declaratory tone. You're going to sound really, like, arrogant. But I, but we, we have to chat. We have to. So, uh, Daigaku. Yep, that's school. College. Daigakura. And then just... Oh, Daigaku da. 
Okay, and then we'll just put die at the end. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> um, so that's Daigakura. Uh, maybe another face there. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, is not high school. Um, Koko. Uh, Koko Janai. Okay, 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 okay. I think uh, Koko Janai. Oh yeah, that's 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 a word. That's a word. Yeah, Koko Janai. Um, damn, good. Was teacher. Uh, was Janai. Was a teacher. Sensei. Sensei datta. Uh. Sensei Dappa. Yep, that's right, Kanji. Yeah! Nice, nice, nice. Oh my goodness, chat. I'm like... <coughs> Otonada. Actually, let me like lower like the font a bit. My spacing's off. Okay, so... This one's Oton Otonada. Otonada. Uh... Yeah, not sure why it's like adding a dot dot there. It's an adult, okay, whatever. Yeah, like it's 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 a it's, a, it's a ongoing struggle with um with Windows. Windows, no, I don't want to talk. I don't want me like that. Yeah. Um, was not child. Um, was not child. Kodomo janakata. Uh, kodomo janakata. Yep, definitely. So this is a child. Um, uh, accomplished. Yeah, so definitely a child. So this is basically child. Janakata. Was not. Um, sorry. Was not child. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, I'm, I'm covering it a bit. Sorry. Um, yeah, so child. And Janakata. Uh, janakata. Ja, ja, ja. So that's ja. That's not what it is. Japanese don't. Ja. Ja, 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 ja. Um, and... This was the way it was? What the? Ah, sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. Okay, okay, okay. Um, kore datta. Eh? Kore. Uh. Kore. This was. Kore datta. Did I say that right? We will figure it out. We will figure it out. Um, so, kore datta, kore datta, ko datta. Kore datta, ko datta. Holy Christ, that's a lot of hiragana. Um, or I probably miss, I'm probably like over conjugating. Right? Um, kore. Yeah, it's because this. Kore, the way it was, things are this way. Kore datta, this was the way it was. Things are the way, this was the way it was. So, this way. Ko, 
da da. I could probably be over conjugating, but I'm a learner. <laughs> uh, wasn't that over there? Um, uh, wasn't that? Sore. Sore janakata. Sore janak. Wasn't. Sorry, sorry, not cut the are. Sorry, you're not cut the are. See, I, I kind of sound like still. I'm still speaking in English. I still. That's 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 freaky. I, I feel like I'm still speaking English there. Um. Uh. Sorry, you're not cut the are. Sorry, you're not cut the are. Or oh, what's that over there? Maybe I should put in like a dot. Yeah. Yeah. I know, like the Japanese have like this strange thought and things. I don't know why. Um. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so, um. Uh. Sorry. Sore Janakata Are uh, Was it that over there? Okay. Um is not middle school. Sore Janakata Are Sore Janakata Are Is not middle school. Uh it's not middle school. Shugaku Janai. So, middle school. Shugaku uh, Janai. Shugaku. Yep. Take two. So, middle. Uh, study. School. Janai. Um, and I put a dot there at the end. Uh, yeah. Is not middle school. Shugaku Janai. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Damn. Oh crap. I'm running out of like um. Ooh, this is bad. This is bad. Um, let me let me um. I didn't expect like the um the exercise to be this long. Okay. Cool. And um, uh, let me just raise this up a bit. Uh, there you go. Let's raise it up. Yeah, I, I, I'm just winging this. Like I didn't expect like to uh, get to this point where I have to like uh, manipulate some assets just so you guys can kind of like see what what I'm where I'm going through with this. Um, raise it up. There you go. Too high. Okay, there you go. Uh oh, oh, I probably need to format things a bit here. Sorry about that. Let me just um Oh. Maybe I'm make it bigger. There you go. Uh and um probably raise it up a bit once more. to be a much simpler way to do this. Oh, that's not middle school. No, my, my, my answers are like meshing together. No! Okay, so, uh, hang on. Let me just click here for a minute, chat. Maybe, maybe it has to do with this. No, I have nothing to do with that. It, it's it's literally the font. Um, eh, I'll have to make it smaller. Uh, yeah, it's not lining up, chat, with what's in the lines there. Sorry about this. Give me a moment. Or uh, we will resume 
once I have everything aligned here. I think we I think we got a winner, chat. I think we got a winner. Alright. Alright, let's let's continue. Um my, my head's blocking the way. <laughs> Sorry about that. Uh Tomo Dachi da. Tomo Uh Tomo da. Alright, this guy. That was easy. Um, yeah, that's fun. Funny enough, um, was not car. Oh, sorry, I forgot to put the dot there. Was not car. Ah, uh, Wow, there you go. You see, this is the car. A single character. And the rest is just conjugation. Uh, so, uh, yeah. Japanese is kind of funky. Uh, was this? Uh, no. I might probably get wrong, get this wrong, Chad. But um, was this is kore datta? Kore datta? Yeah. Why is it? Why is it? Why is it super long? Kore datta. Yeah. Wait, what? Why did Why did Windows tell me that to do that? Oh. Yeah, this, this is what I want. What the hell? <coughs> Alright, so, um, what's this? Yeah. Cool. And, um, basically, the next one is that's not the way it is. <laughs> uh, that, uh, so, <coughs> sore, sore janai. Sore janai ko. Sore, sore, sore janai ko. Sore janai ko, sore janai ko. Ah! Sore janai, sore, sore janai ko da, ko da. Sore janai ko da. Sore janai ko da. I think? Oh man. All right. Well, uh, moment of truth. Um, we're going to move, uh, the, um, uh, the answers here or, um, oh crap. Okay. I may, I may need to move this then. Uh, yeah. Okay. So, oh, let me move myself then. Okay. And um, yeah, man, this is the this is the new format, Chad. Going forward, this is the new format. <laughs> um, yeah, yeah. Let's 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 go toggle the answers. Um, am I close? Yeah, I got first one right. I got the second one right as well. I got the third one right, yeah. I got the fourth one right. I got the fifth one right as well. Yeah, yeet. Oh, this this was the way it was. Ko ah so ah ko ko datta. Eh? This. This was the way it was. What did I write there? Um. This was the way it was. This was. Oh, I. I oh, I. I. I added. Uh, oh, okay. I added kore. Oh, yeah. That's not good. That's not good. This was the way it was. Kore. No, 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 no. It's ko. Ko datta. It has to be this. 
um, this is not right. Uh, oh, da, da. There it is. See, it's correct now. Okay, this this was the way it was. Cool, that that. All right, all right. I got thrown off by this. As long as like you know this way, as long as there's a this way, we we don't need to add in the kores and sores. Uh, cool, that that. This was the way it was. Damn. No. Look how look how many syllables uh, we saved there. So this was the way it was. Six syllables. And in Japanese, you can pretty much say the same thing with just three syllables. Go da da. Apparently that's the thing. And um, what was the way it was? Wasn't that over there? Okay. Okay. Um. I see. I messed up there. I messed up in that one. Um. Uh, was it that over there? I said, "Sore, sore janai." Uh, sore, sorry, sore janakata. Are? But the proper way of saying it. Or the correct way of saying it. Are janakat. Are janakata. Are janakata. Wasn't that over there? Oh yeah, you're right. Oh my god, yeah, yeah, yeah. Are janakata. Wasn't that over there? Why did I think of it that way? Um. Wasn't that over there? So that over there wasn't. Yeah, that that over there was not. Yeah, why? I got thrown away by the that. Yeah, that over there. Oh, I I was fixated with that. Yeah, maybe we could just say uh, yeah. Are janakata. Okay, are janakata. There you go. Uh, yeah, that's basically what I what this wrote what is written in that website. So. Uh, uh yeah apparently uh i missed that one uh middle school i think i got that right middle school uh-huh uh-huh yeah 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 um uh what's, what's this what's this um is a friend tomodachi da yeah correct uh, what's this? Uh, Kuroma Janakata is not a, was not a car. Was not a car. Kuroma Janakata. Yeah, correct. And uh, was this? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Did I get that right? Oh, I got that right. Okay, what's, it? what's this? Um, eh, ko kore, ko kore datta. Yeah. And that's not the way it is. Um, yep, I knew it. I knew it. I I knew I was wrong there. Um, basically, it's um, so janai. Oh janai. Oh datta. Oh datta. That's not the way it is. This ko ko janai. Okay, if I, if I if I was to say. That's not the way. This was not the way it is. I would have said ko janai. But if it's if I if I'm saying that's not the way it is, so janai. So, so janai. It's not sore janai, which I said here. Uh, sore jana janai. Sore janai ko. Ko da. I'm just, I'm just making things up. Um. Okay. So, so yeah, that's not the way. So Janai, yeah. Basically, this. So Janai. See, that's how it is. Um. Yeah. Holy shit. I um. Okay. I I screwed up. 
uh where on the the ways and stuff yeah what's in that over there are janai are janakata yeah are yeah that over there yeah the rest i pretty much was able to get get yeah i i, I fumbled with the kore sores and ares and then the souls and cores so again uh kore this sore that are that over there um uh ko this way uh so that way and you basically just conjugate the hell out of it oh okay um yeah uh i'm gonna like stop myself there um but uh yeah uh I'm gonna go look for someone to raid, uh, because yeah, I, my brain is like about to literally blow up. It's it's like I just did my first conjugation exercise. I got a seven out of ten, um, or no, a nine out of twelve, a passing grade. Um, and yeah, it's 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 um. I mean, of course, I was like looking at the cheat sheet over there but that's not the point the point is i was able to conjugate satisfactorily or adequately so uh again as i said before like you don't want to like put yourself down too hard it's okay to make mistakes we will review this in the next installment and it should be like just poof it just you know just nothing it's just like nothing um Okay, uh, we'll probably, like, wanna go check out, I don't know, what are we gonna check out? Um, uh, Virida? I mean, I, 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 I like, I like Virida's streams, um, she's playing Identity V, again, she plays, like, the most obscure games, I love it, uh, so, uh, if you guys, like, are into that, you're in for a treat, if not, I mean, just, 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 just stay, just stay put, say hi, you know, I really appreciate it, and, uh, yeah, it's, um, again, I am very grateful that you guys, like, you know, like, we're here to kind of, like, learn together, and, like, for me to be able to, like, kind of, like, get some things off my chest, but, yeah, uh, next stream will be, uh, to, on Saturday, uh, we'll be, we'll have a Divinity collab with Krim and Servo, and, uh, yeah, that'll be fun, that'll be fun, all right, I think that's it for moi. Uh, thank you guys for like um, uh, tuning in. And yeah, I hope to see you again in the next one. Bye now.